Hello and a very good afternoon. Good morning as well. Uh, welcome to Crafters TV. My name's Ben Mosby. Oh, what a laugh we have here, don't we? What a laugh. We've had a brilliant day so far. We had a masterclass earlier on. Um, and now it is all about cartload. Now, if you've not seen this show before, this is our sales show, if you like. We have got amazing, amazing deals and so many of them. If you've not seen this show before, it's fast, it's furious. It's basically first come, first served on a lot of items as well because we've got low stock levels. So my tip, I mean, take it or leave it. Most people tend to leave it. But my tip is if you see something like, get it in your basket, in your cart and check it out as quick as you can because it's likely it could sell out. That's all I will say. We've got amazing deals of up to 70% off. So if there's something you want to see, if there's something you want to know, if there's something you want to show, get in touch with us. And I will tell you, we're that busy, we have had sellout before the show. I'll recap on that in just a second, but let me tell you who is going to be with me over the course of the next few hours. One of my absolute faves, <laughs> maybe the fave, but I'm not allowed to have faves, <laughs> is the lovely Debbie Robinson. Hi, hi Ben. I'm so happy to be here this Thursday afternoon. Really looking forward to the show. And I can't believe, Ben, there's been some sellouts before. I've got so much planned and I've really hastily having to be redoing yeah. things in this little short, short gap that I've had in between the shows. But I'm so excited because we've got some fabulous, fabulous things lined up for you this afternoon. It's a bit of a difficult one for you guys, isn't it? Because obviously you prepare a certain amount of demos ready for the show. And on a show like Cartload, where things sell out, all the demos go out the window. So basically, you know, Debbie has to do a bit of improv. That's what's going to happen. A bit of De Debbie improv in the show. That's what we're looking <laughs> forward to. Um, but we did have a last chance section, okay? But the last chance section has become now like a no chance section because so many of the last last chance, why am I saying last chance? I say last chance. I've been hanging around with you guys too much. Uh, <laughs> the last chance or last chance, right? Uh, this is what we had in the last chance um, collection, all right? We had these amazing dying stamp sets. That one sold out. That one sold out. This one, that's sold out. This, lovely, isn't it? Sold out. You know this one here? Oh, I love those little flutes. That's gone. I mean, oh, I mean, are you kidding me? This, look, it's gone. Uh, this one here, absolutely stunning. What, it's gone. Then we've got that, that's gone. Next, it, no, that's not here either. Oh, look at this one here. Oh, that is so cute with the little tip. That's gone. And then, oh my goodness me. This is the fox glove. Absolutely gorgeous. Gone. <laughs> All sold out, all gone. I'm gonna I'm just, I'm gonna put them over here. I'll tell you what we have got though. Let's put those out of the way. We have still got these uh, amazing stamp and die sets. So, as I've just proved, things are selling out and going very fast because look at the deals that we've got for you today. The Gemini stamp and die cupcake collection. So you've got this beautiful cupcake stamp with the dies to be able to um, cut this out as well. Three pounds or four dollars, sixty percent saving today on all of these. But as you've seen, lots have already gone. Those are your beautiful cupcakes. We've also got from this collection this absolutely stunning peacock. Um, and again, it comes with the dies for you to be able to cut that out of your cardstock. That's three pounds or four dollars on a sixty percent saving for you. We've then got this absolutely magnificent poinsettia. Uh, again, there you can see your die cut and blades to be able to uh, stamp this and cut this out as well for uh, £3 or $4. Also still just about hanging on in there. This is absolutely gorge. These are your angel wings. I've never seen a stamp quite like those actually and it's lovely, isn't it? You get your die as well, £3 or $4. All of these, as I said, limited stock so you've got to go quickly if you want them. And then, ah yes! I love a Christmas pudding, you know, when they, you, you light it, don't you? And then you get all the flames going and stuff. And oh yeah, amazing. I'm looking forward to Christmas. Now it's officially the 1st of October. Anyone else feel a little bit Christmassy? I certainly do. I'm on the countdown to Christmas already. Three pounds or $4 for your Christmas pud. But you want to know what's on the show. So let's do a quick rundown of some of what we think will be the most popular items that you'll need to get your hands on. Right, I am not kidding you. This is the uh, Crafter's Companion uh, 3D layering stencil collection. The deal on this is absolutely phenomenal, right? It's If you've seen the shows that we've done recently with stencils, you'll know how effective that they can be. These are your 3D stencils, so giving you even more depth and dimension. You're going to get with this French Fine, the Postmark Paris, City Skyline and Carte Postale, that's postcard, 
for those of you that don't speak French. I did know French. Um, but listen, the price on these normally, right, each one normally would be $9.99 or $11.95. Today, for the lot, you pay $11.98 or $14.34. The price on that is ridiculous. So basically, you're, you're, you're saying, well, you're buying one and then for the other three, you're paying like $1.99 here in the UK. That's an unbelievable buy. Don't miss out on that. Next up, if you're into your foil, uh, foil stamping, these are popular as well. We had a foil stamping uh, 101, didn't we, the other day, foil press. Uh, this is the uh, five piece set, the Christmas Stamp and Die Cut Collection. This one comes with um, all the happiness, uh, expressions, Christmas blessing, uh, Christmas wonder, the greatest gifts, and tis the season. Uh, again, on that, 1697 or 2285. Um, they will, of course, foil and cut at the same time, saving 40% on that particular deal. Next up, this is why we call it cartload, because your basket and your cart's getting big, your, biggie, bigger already, I can tell. Uh, next up, we've got your uh, 5x7 embossing folder collection. This is absolutely gorgeous as well. We'll show you more of these in the studio um, as and when we can through the show, but this one uh, brings you some super ones. You've got your Christmas centerpiece. Also, joy to the world, peace on earth, Holly frame and under the mistletoe. 14 pounds or $22. That again is a half price deal for everybody. Next up, we want to see some sugar cards, sugar cards, cocktails and love always duo this um, with 26 elements included. Just brilliant is this collection. Um, I do have this somewhere in the studio and we'll get it out for you at some point. Oh, there we go. There it is. There's your little cocktail. Yeah, so brilliant for creating your shaker cards. Use a fabulous stamp and die set uh, and then, you know, get your uh, aperture created, add your acetate, your bead sequins, whatever it might be and create some awesome, awesome cards. 60% off everybody. £11 or $15.50. .50. So get, uh, guess what? 20% of that stock has already gone. Now, next up, these are brilliant. First time I've seen these, the creator cards. I've not seen these before. I hear everybody going on about them at Crafters TV. The creator cards, these are brilliant. So they will, I mean, they'll create your kind of mats and layers for you if you want to, but they basically also just create a brilliant card. So who wouldn't want a shirt card, for example? Um, so the Get Dressed is already limited stock. Uh, that comes with 30 elements to be able to, you know, uh, pop it all together to pop in all of the different um, sentiments as well, maybe for Father's Day, a retirement, a birthday, a party, whatever it might be. £17 or $23, uh, saving £12.98 or £16.98. Now, also in this um, creator card slot, we've got the sweet treat. I mean, this is amazing with the cupcake. £17 or $23. Again, with all of those different sentiments allowing you to completely customise your card uh, for whatever the celebration. Next up, who wouldn't want a card shaped as a dress? This is be fabulous, fabulous, darling. Uh, you've got your uh, celebrate. Uh, you've got your you shall go to the ball stamp included in that as well. It is twenty three elements in total, seventeen pounds or twenty three dollars. We did have more of the creator cards, but um, sadly, those have sold out. Things will sell out in the show. Things will go limited stock. Um, I must just say a very good afternoon and a good morning already to a few viewers who are already in. Um, Robin Miller, uh, Diane Blils uh, Bilsen from Indiana, Sherilyn Moses from South Carolina, Patty from Wisconsin, and from Connecticut, uh, Cyruski from Illinois, Lisa from Texas, and uh, Linda from Florida. I'll show you another thing we've got on the show. Uh, Julia on Facebook says, apparently, Ben, your kissy noise sounds like a dog toy. Uh, just got the puppy very excited. Does that mean you want me to do it again, or do you not want me to do it again? I don't know. I'll do it again. There you go. <laughs> I'm going to ring a doorbell in a minute. That'll be fun, won't it, for everyone who's got dogs? No, I won't, don't worry. Uh, right, uh, ne <laughs> next up. Now, I, I won't lie to you, we had a lot of stock of this because this has appeared on Cartload definitely last week and I think the week before as well and of a huge stock of this autumn card and paper pack. Uh, how much of this has gone? 40% has already gone. You are loving this, and um, I think it's a great, great selection because you're getting any two of these for £10. Look at the colours. Well, first of all, look at that beautiful sheen that you get on the cardstock. And of course, we've just rolled into October. And what happens in October? Well, yes, you do have pumpkin pie, producer Laura. Uh, yes, Debbie? It's my birthday. Uh, well, <laughs> yeah, Debbie, it is your birthday next week, but I'm just looking for something a bit more. Oh, what oh. else happens in the. October. Uh, 
Halloween. Halloween. <laughs> Aye, that's right, Debbie. It's Halloween. Uh, yes, yeah, so Halloween is what happens. Uh, so this is perfect, <laughs> perfect colours for Halloween, for autumn, for Debbie's birthday, and for pumpkins. Uh, now, as you can see, you can get you get a selection of cardstock and different papers uh, in different colourways as well. But it's gorge, gorge, gorgeous. Five ninety nine or nine ninety nine. You get fifty sheets of paper, fifty sheets of the cardstock. Any two for a tenner, or any two for sixteen dollars. Next up. Now the spray and sparkle. We don't have this very often on a cartload, but it is sadly this is UK only, so apologies to our American viewers. Uh, but the spray and sparkle you're going to get in three colours. So you've got your pearl glitter, you've also got your gold glitter, and then you've got your silver glitter as well. And I guess first time I've seen this actually, I guess it does exactly what it says on the bottle. Really, um, you give it a spray, and it gives you some sparkle. I, I, I guess, yeah, getting the nod. Thirteen ninety eight for all three of those, which is amazing. So make sure you get those uh, into your basket and get a bit of sparkle in your life. Um, fill up your baskets, honestly, because we don't want you to miss out on the deals that we've got. And uh, we're gonna go over to Debbie, who is having a bit of a look, oh, at the creator cards, the sweet treats. And the rest as well, Ben, because oh. I thought I'll show you a few samples of some of what you can be doing with it. Now, I am going to be starting with the sweet treats. And again, these are absolutely fabulous. These creator cards really do simply create the most beautiful shaped card. Look how gorgeous that sweet treats one is, Ben. It's absolutely Ooh, fabulous. Love it. And it's a fun card as well. It's a freestanding card, but you get to be able to create the shapes. There's some of these that are, I mean, they're literally hanging on by a thread. So that's all I'm going to say, Ben. Head over to that website and go and check them out. This is that beautiful best dress. We've got bottles up. Ooh. Wait a minute. Bottles or bottoms bottles up? up not bottoms. bottles up. Bottles <gasps> up. I was going to say bottoms up. Don't ask me why I was thinking bottoms up. Well, because you say bottoms up when you drink your drink, <laughs> don't you? Bottoms We've up. We've got time for tea. And again, the way that you can use them, um, Ben, is literally just to shut. Oh, oh my goodness. Put that minute. down, Debbie. Put it down. Hold the phone. Time for tea. And the bottles up. They're out of here. You're out. They're gone. <laughs> <laughs> well, let's just talk about the rest then. What we yeah. do have, we've got the beautiful Bee Fabulous, and she is absolutely beautiful. But again, you can use them in so many ways. Absolutely so many ways, Ben. You can use them as toppers on the front of your cards. You can use them as, as beautiful sh uh, shaped cards and literally change the style up um, on how you're going to use this. But I'm going to show you one that I know we've got in stock. Have we? And just. Are you sure? Just, yeah, only just, which is the beautiful sweet treat one. Yes. Now, I want to show you exactly how it comes to you. So you get a set of dies to be able to create your own um, style card blank. And the way that we will start this, Ben, is we're just going to use two main ones. But on rest of here, we've got a flag in here, which oh, yeah. I think is absolutely perfect to stick on the top of your bun. Yes. You've got a love heart. You've got a candle, so you can put some candles in for how many birthdays that is. I'll just pop my hand there so you can see it. We've got a tag on there, and we've even got a cherry as well. So it's a real great great uh, system but these two pieces are going to be the main worker part of the die uh, so sorry to how to put the card together so first things first i'm going to take some white stamping card i've actually just folded it over yeah now this one you're going to do in two pieces and the best way i can show you to keep your card connected is to hang it over the edge of your card so over the card fold if i hang that over the edge i know that that card top is going to stay interconnected into there so let's bring in the plates bring pop in that the onto plates. there bring in this over the edge i'm going to stick it down with a little bit of uh, sticky tape or low tack tape and then again your plate combination with it being a thin metal die is just your normal thin metal die combination of your plastic shim magnetic shim and your other putting plate as well and you just run those through your gemini now these are small enough to go through your gemini junior uh, but if you don't have a gemini they will go through other manual machines as well the only problem one that they won't go through is the very small ones that okay. they take for three by six but anything bigger than that absolutely fine now because i've left a left i don't know what i'm in my words today because i've left <laughs> left it i was going to say left it because left 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 i've lifted that in there it means now that part stays connected and it, it, it just keeps that all together ben what you're then going to do is take whatever chosen cardstock, and this time I'm going to use some craft cards. Yeah. I'm going to use the bottom panel, and I'm going to pop those two. I'm going to run both through together. 
hold it, hold it down again with a little bit of low tack tape and then we'll put these over the top and now, then again just run those through whilst you're just your running machine. those through yep. gotta say a big thank you to everybody who's been in touch probably lots of people have been in touch uh, wishing debbie a happy birthday it's not actually her birthday today <laughs> you've misunderstood that uh, but thank you. It is Debbie's birthday. When is your actual birthday, Debbie? It is next Thursday. It's the week today, week the eighth of October. It is. Yeah, and you're going to be twenty. Twenty-one again. Twenty-one again. Twenty-one, 21 plus again. fat. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Oh, shh. less of the shh. Okay. Plus fat. Okay. Sorry about I th that. I thought we about. were friends. I thought we were friends. We are. Well, we are. Can I just sorry? Whilst you're just doing, whilst you're just uh, cutting that, you know the uh, the grand peacock that we had here. Yes. Uh, for the um, the stamp and die collection, that one, that one. Uh, it's sold out. And also, if you've got that one in your basket, uh, well, that you get, get it checked out because that's going to go. First come, first serve on the cupcakes. Right, back to you. Oh, I love those. Honestly, I'm not surprised that they're, they've, you know, they're not lasting. Now, I've cut those two pieces out. You saw me just do that there. It's cut two pieces of craft card out. I've got my lovely piece, uh, my top piece. Mm, I've yeah. actually cut into a spare piece of cardstock because I want that to fit over the top. And what that actually does as well is covers, up, covers over that top quite nice and neatly as well. So I'm just going to run some tape over the top and place that into um, over the top, Ben. And literally, that will just just line along the top and then what we're going to do is we're going to stick the bottom of the pup pup cake what's a pup cake, a pup cake. you it's and a, your pups it's a cupcake for a puppy <laughs> a pup and i'm just going to run that over again i'm just going to put a bit of tape just on this edge and i'm just going to line that up and stick that over the top and it also gives that lovely nice cupcake feature at the back and then i'm going to do exactly the same but to make sure i'm going to get it lined up into place i'm going to hold that down directly over the top I'm going to hold that and then place this over the top so I know that I've got that perfect fold now that when I open it up then I've got the perfect fold and it holds there absolutely perfectly. Now I'm just going to, and I'll show you in a minute because we're going to do a little bit more decoration, I'm going to just pop on here a little bit of a ribbing going around the bottom and showing you as well, when we talk about creator cards, yeah. you can create a card instantly and super, super quick, but it's a real fancy fold as well, absolutely. which I think is absolutely fab, Ben. You pay lots of money in shops for things like this and I can't get over the price of these today. They're absolutely fabulous. I've already pre-cut out one of those love hearts, so I'm just going to pop that on the front as well. Uh -huh. So that'll go there. And then lastly, we've even got the cherry. Now, I've cut the cherry out a couple of times, so I've cut it out into uh, red and also brown. I'm going to layer that over the top, but I want that to just sit over the top as well. So again, you can create a really nice effect. Let me just bring the one in that I've done. So I've just taken that off and it, it's my little cherry that's going to stick on the top. <gasps> I'm looking for my 3D Kalal glue, Ben. 3D oh, Kalal glue. I've, we got it. Is. I've got it. I've got it. That's not your 3D Kalal glue. It is. It's in my pot. Oh. It's not in my little, it's not in my little syringe. I haven't fetched me. Isn't that um, your, uh, isn't that your chunky glue? It is my chunky glue. I but I I I've never heard I, you call I, it by its proper name. <laughs> Yeah, well, no one ever hears me call it by its proper name, but it, it, it is. It's me. It's my lovely chunky glue. I'm going to put my little cherry on the top, and then I'm just going to finish that off with a little with love sentiment that I'm just going to run across and stick that into place just over the top. So with a bit of love, and how fast, quick, and super easy was that to put together but to create something really, really quite effective. And I mean, look at it, Ben, it's absolutely fabulous. These creator cards yeah. instantly create a card. It took how long to put that together? Uh, Let's just hold that into place so you can see there. About four Again, minutes. Yeah, it didn't take that long. This no. is what I'm talking about. These creator cards are absolutely sensational. It doesn't matter which design you go for, which one do you love the most? Ooh. Go for honestly, it's absolutely fabulous. Shall we do another one? Well, I tell you what, let's do it. Give uh, me a what, second, then, what, then. Okay, what I would say is, we do, the creator cards are selling out. We've still got the sweet treats. We've still got the uh, fabulous, be fabulous, and the best dressed as well. It's called best dressed, not get dressed. <laughs> 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 um, I've on the part. I think it's called best dressed. Get dressed. That's what I say to my kids in the morning when they're like getting ready, not getting ready for school. Get dressed. Um, the reason why I've got this on uh, the counter here, by the way, is because um, we've got these amazing um, Ditto tote uh, bags. We've got them in various colours, but the pink 
is sold out. It's gone. We've got the black available for you and also the turquoise. And basically, look, they're really, really cool uh, because um, you've got this really like um, hard top to them with the comfortable carry handles. Um, it's a really, really sturdy carry case. And then the brilliant thing is you've got all of these uh, different um, spaces in there as well for, um, well, all of your crafty goodies, really. Love the fact that you've got the see through pockets as well so you can see exactly what is in there. Um, as I say, the turquoise is, is it, did you say the turquoise is almost gone? Yeah, turquoise, almost gone. Black available, 2079 on 1999, saving 20%. Pink has sold out. Um, Deanne on uh, YouTube saying, loving that colour on Debbie. Lots of uh, love for your top today, Debbie. Um, and uh, Pamela says, Debbie, we get to celebrate our birthday month. Yes, anyone in October, you get to celebrate for the month, don't you? And uh, Hannah on Facebook says, hi guys, watching whilst at work, roll on five o'clock. Now, we don't encourage people to watch at work, but uh, if you can get away with it, who cares? Uh, <laughs> and we're going to go back over to Debbie because she's going to do another card. What are you doing now? Best dress, did you say? No, 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 no. Oh, no. fabulous. Be fabulous, ah, Ben. Darling. Be fabulous because this one is a gorgeous one as well. And this is that beautiful dress design. So let me just show you. Oh, I'll just show you this one here. You can see that beautiful dress design. And again, it's one of those freestanding cards that stand perfectly. Yeah. And you're going to be able to create this again super, super quick, super, super easy and super fabulous because it's more than be fabulous. It's super fabulous and it's a beautiful dress design here again you've got all the accessories on here we've got a handbag we've got shoes we've got a collar we've got a floral we've got a bow there's all sorts on here Ben mm. to be able to create something absolutely fabulous now again I've taken this time some black stamp uh, black matte cardstock again I've put a fold through the middle because the way to get the interconnected part Ben yeah. and bearing in mind this is a, a much thicker die than a thin metal die it's not a multimedia die but it means you can cut through a couple of layers it's slightly thicker than a, a thin metal die so you can actually get that two-piece cut but again to create that um the stay where it stays in the cardstock you just need to hang it over the fold so you can see i've got a little bit of a gap just over the top i pop my um board back down so you can see there and i'm going to place it on this way this time hang that over the edge again you're going to use some low tack tape just to hold it in place where you want that to be you can put some down at the bottom but because we're on a uh, cart load i'm going to risk it for the biscuit do it i am going to put that through there <laughs> And then we're going to run that through to create that perfect card blank. And again, these are going to fit through your junior upward size machines, uh, but they're absolutely perfect and they do create a card absolutely instantly. And I absolutely love that factor about that. The fact that you can create fun shaped cards in an instant yeah. is just amazing. So this now stays interconnected into the cardstock Boom. again. So you now know that you've got your front and your back all in one go. It's absolutely fabulous. And I can't believe, well, I can believe actually, Ben, the way this is going. Well, yeah. It's just 40% gone. Absolutely crazy. Now I've got some. Uh, glitter card stock we're going to call it then it is glitter card stock i'm going to run through a couple of little of these pieces there's even a little bow on here with its tail as well there's a waistband honestly this is fabulous and there's even look we've even got a little handbag on there as well it's absolutely fabulous so just run those through um just whilst you're running through stop press stop press i've just got i'm, I'm trying to keep up with everything here on cart load right best dressed Best dressed is the one with the shirt. I was looking forward to because I like, look at that one there that you could have done with the, that, the little kilt. That, that's, that's what Craig wears in his spare time. <laughs> uh, unfortunately, you can't do that anymore because it's sold out. The uh, uh, best dress has gone. Sweet dreams and be fabulous. The only one's left. So let's have a look at the demo with Debbie. Right, so I've just been running those pieces through. I'm just going to put all my dies back on here though for a second, Ben, because I know what I'm like. Yeah. I'll end up losing pieces. But look again, that thickness cuts through even glitter card stock in one pack of your machine and this is the fun part now you just start to build, build these all together now I've already run through and, and given myself a little bit of a heat embossing with um, a little floral stamp that I've got because what I'm going to do is over my card blank yep. I'm going to place that on the bottom so again just going to pop some glue just on the bottom is this what you're Marry wearing next up. Thursday for your birthday oh absolutely I love what, my dresses what your love birthday dresses. plans what are you doing uh, I'm gonna just spend it with my um with my family I'm, I've got me me um my daughter and obviously my little granddaughter live at home with me for the time being Ben yeah 
<laughs> they've, they've got they've got their own house, so oh. we're just wait, waiting for them to move in, Ben. Oh. So, uh, so I'm going to make excited? the most of this last bit. No, no, I'm actually, absolutely not. Oh. No, I am for her, but I'm not for me. I'm being a bit selfish. <laughs> but yes, yeah, so I'm going to spend the day with her. My eldest daughter lives in Bristol, so that's why I went down at the beginning of the month so I could go and spend a bit of time with her uh, because I know I can't spend it with her on my birthday. But uh, yeah, so I'm uh, I'm really looking forward to it. I'm having a day off. I can't oh. wait. I can't say, wait. At least you're not working on your birthday. That's nice. No, I know. I know. My rule, my rule of thumb is uh, every year, birthdays are very special in my house. Yeah. Any birthday, regardless what age you are. And um, you don't work on your birthday. I used Apart to work from last year. I oh. had to work last year. Oh. Yeah, it were, but it were here. It were with oh. Leanne and the team. But that's not really So work, it went too it? bad. No, it went too bad. We were having a bit of training session. So quite quite enjoyed it. We had lots of cake. It were really lovely. Good though. So yes, I'm looking forward to it. I'm looking forward to spending some time with the... Uh, with my loved ones, as you do. Excellent. Right, so I'm just going to pop this on here. I'm going to put a little shoe just in one area. I've already pre-done some of these, Ben, but just to speed things up, because it is cartload, and we all know it's a fast, furious show, and again, uh, things don't hang around for very long. No, totally <laughs> they don't. already. So again, I'm just going to put a little bit of chunky glue in the middle of my bow, so let's pop a little bit here. I feel a little bit lost without my craft kit today. Um, I've left it at home, Ben. Oh, don't ask. Oh, well, I left it at home by mistake. But there ah. we go. Look, pop those two together. And there you go. Super quick, easy card. Creator card. Fancy shape. Fabulous price today only. And don't hang around. Please don't hang around. If there's something you've seen, please do go and have a, have a little uh, look. What's left, did you say? No. Yeah, the sweet treats and be fabulous. That's no. all. We've got left Debbie's jaw Dropped. almost hitting the floor. Love that. There's your uh, your sweet treats. That is oh, one I big love old that, cupcake ben. there, triple layer. What you got? Oh, I'm just going, I'm just going back with over. the one that I've got. I've got the lovely little dinky one there. Oh. You can see that beautiful dinky one in our in our lovely colour. But this is the thing, you can do them on the side. You can do them at the top. Where's the one that I just did, Ben? I'll put it down somewhere. I don't know where I've done with it. But you can do it from the top, you can do it from the side. You can you can actually use these as toppers and place them on. The one you've just shown is that beautiful triple layered icing one. Yeah. Absolutely fabulous. Look at that on a card. So you can you just use it, like you say, as your little topper as well, can't you? Absolutely. It's incredible and i love these effects you've got some beautiful samples there ben absolutely beautiful they are fabulous right take a tip from the top take a tip from debbie robertson and get these now whilst you can uh, the be fabulous stamp will go uh, as will the sweet treats that will go as well so make sure you get it we're so busy we've had so many sellouts already um, so get these whilst you can right ben put your specs on i've just seen i've got a cake here i, I forgot about that thank you producer laura left me a little cake in there a minute ago i might, might, might eat that halfway uh right um I might need the sugar, I'll tell you what, at this pace. The uh, Christmas foil and um, stamp and cut for your um, stamping and cutting, funnily enough. We've got a little collection here, uh, which is absolutely gorgeous. Um, so we're going to give you uh, the five piece set. So these obviously will um, uh, foil and cut as you go. So this is your Christmas blessings. I might just sort of flip it around on the back so you can see. Uh, a little bit better as to the font that you're going to get on there. Also included in this collection, you've got wishing you all the happiness your holiday can hold. There you go. Just flipping it around so you just get a bit of a look at these. Really cute. So the fact that say you can foil and cut with these as well and just going to give you that sort of more expensive look with the uh, the foiling that you get with this. That is your celebrate. You're then also going to get tis the season to be jolly. I won't sing it. Or maybe I will. Tis the season to be jolly. There you go. And then finally, you're also going to get some of the greatest gifts. Oh, I like that. Some of the greatest gifts are family and friends. Now, you're thinking to yourself, well, 16.97. Is that for one, two, three? All of them. For the lot. Uh, you're saving almost £12 or $16 on those. So get those in your basket swiftly. Uh, now, we've also got... Uh, the uh, stamp and die sets, the circular sentiments. These are really cool as well. Um, so let's get these in order with what you've got on the screen. So first of all, you've got your good luck. So you've got your little um, uh, horseshoe and uh, four leaf clover 
stamp there as well. And then you've got this really cool die set as well to pop your uh, good luck message in the center of. Love that. And with the good luck around the outside as well. 3.99 or 6.47. It's a half price deal. Really, really love that. Uh, next up, I haven't got a. I haven't got one of those. But so I'm so sorry. I haven't got the so sorry. But that is available for you. It's limited. 3.99, 6.47 uh, for the so so, so sorry. Um, next up, we've got. Hang on a minute. Feel better. Ah, now this one's very cool again. So you get that circular uh, die with the little um, sentiment around the outside. And then, look at that. You've got your little cup of coffee, which is good because what was today? What is today? National Coffee Day, International Coffee Day. Uh, so there you go. There's your little fun cup of coffee. Look with his little smiley face and you can cut him out as well using that die included. Next up is your congratulations. Again, beautiful. No, not as I sing it. Uh, uh, you got, you've got your beautiful die. There's your congratulations around the outside, and then you can cut out your uh, stamp, which this time is those champagne flutes. That one is limited stock, uh, so that's going to go. And one more to show you, have I? Oh, yes, which is your special day. And in craft, how much do we love our butterflies? A lot is the answer, and that's what you get here. Uh, special day with that beautiful butterfly. Again, you've got all of these dies, and then that uh, die to cut out your butterfly too. Three ninety nine or six forty seven for those. Uh, really love that collection. Um, Julia's loving the show so far. These are fantastic fast cards, says Julia. Yes, they are. That's what it's all about. That was the creator cards you saw a few moments ago. Fast and Furious uh, on Cartload. Peggy on YouTube says, I love your demos. Thanks, Debbie. Oh, there'll be plenty more demos, plenty more. But let me show you. I think possibly you talk about deals. These for me are phenomenal. Probably the deal of the show, my personal opinion, the Crafters Companion 3D layering stencil collection. Now we've talked a lot about stenciling over the course of the last few weeks, seen lots of stencils on the show. Um, but these are sort of next level really, because they're giving you that real 3D effect and you've got some absolutely beautiful images on these. So let's, oh, Ben's knocked something over. <laughs> Do you know what? I've gone so long without doing that. Oh, bless you. And now, oh, hang on. Wait there. Talk amongst yourselves a second. Just putting the set back together. Right, what was I saying? Ah, uh, yes. These are amazing for the fact that you're gonna get four, okay? So you get French vine, you get your, there's your French vine, your postmark Paris, your city skyline, and your carte postale, right? So these are normally 9.99 each or 11.95. You're getting them all for eleven ninety eight. That's a massive saving, right? <laughs> Deb, someone pick Debbie's <laughs> drawer up off the floor because it just hit the floor. That's unbelievable that you get all of these for that price, and you'll see with each one, you've got those handy over there, haven't you? But I basically, have. you get three layers with each stencil to build up that 3D effect, don't you, Debbie? Absolutely. And can I just say, Ben, yes. Debbie needs to get back to Specsavers because I actually thought that was the price of one. No, it's all of them. Are you telling me you're getting all the yes, lot? Yes, that's what I'm saying. Well, this is def... Oh, can I change my mind, Laura, producer Laura? This is going to be my favourite product. This, me this, this. To, to me have... too. I know, because it's just amazing, though. <laughs> I'm changing my mind about it. Butterfly, shh, shh. This <laughs> is amazing. Look at that price. I love stencils. These are big stencils they're not little stencils big stencils that you can create some really amazing things with with ease and these are things that you can that you can take your texture pastes your glitter pastes your inks your spray and sparkle you can do absolutely anything with a stencil a good stencil and these are fantastic and i can't believe that that's the price for all four i thought it was for the one bed. no that's what i'm saying yeah oh all my four. goodness for, for that price shall i show you how easy they are oh, to use oh yes please absolutely so i'm going to use the carte postel what did you say that was in french because i was going to ask somebody i didn't uh, know what it carte postel is uh, Post, uh, Post Carte Postel or what? It's a postcard. Is it really? It is. I didn't know that. Yes. Take it from I me. Didn't know that. I, I am didn't. going to A level that. French. <laughs> well, they come so easy to use and they come in three different styles. So I think the best way, let me see if I can grab a piece of black cardstock to show you. Because I think showing it on white is a little bit deceiving. Right. But look, look, this is the stat. So that's your layer one. Right. And if I just show you there, straight away, 
beautiful oh, design nice. would look lovely on its own. Yeah. However, when you create that full layering feature, you absolutely Ooh. get the most beautiful design. I'm going to show you just how easy in the steps of one, two, three, how fantastic these are to use. Now, the one thing I would say when you're using uh, a stencil is either use low tack tape to hold this down or you are going to use, um, I would say, the repositional spray and, uh, sorry, yes, wait a minute. Spray, stick, spray, stick, and spray. Stick, and spray. stick and spray, stick and spray. I was just looking in my back then, just see, see if I could uh, hold that down. But because it's cart load, I'm going to just go risk it for a biscuit again, Whoa, and okay. I'm going straight on there. Uh, so I've just taken a piece of white stamping card. I've cut it down to size. These are actually eight by eight in size. They're absolutely fantastic. And if you love making lots of different, um, if you love doing stenciling onto walls or oh, canvases, no or I, do you know what? I went through a stage where I stenciled all my kitchen units. Um, did you really? I did. Indeed. Indeed, yes, well, I did indeed. So you can use so many different uh, types of inks, paints, sprays, inks, and all sorts paints, of stencils, can't sprays, you? Sprays, texture yeah. pastes, yeah. glitter pastes, um, lots and lots of things that you can use these. Now I'm just loading up with a quick dry ink for this particular one. So I'm using our uh, quick dry harmony inks, and these are the pink family. So I've got my pink tulip, which is what I'm putting down first, and yes. I'm just literally just putting down a little bit of colour just over the top. But you could use our water reactive harmony ink pads oh yeah you could use our pigment ink pads and then when you use the pigment ink pads you could lift them off and you could actually use things like your clear embossing and do some embossing techniques over them as well it is so so easy to use but the effects that you get on a layering uh, stencil are fabulous so i could lay down a little bit more color but i'm just going to leave that for one because obviously when you see it come together you'll see how fabulous yes. this works beautiful light color down on stencil one i'm going to bring in stencil two i'm going to change up my color so again i'm just going to go in with a different color this time i've got the fuchsia so i'm going to put the fuchsia over there so let's just hold that into place again if you're not comfortable or confident with a stencil please do use a low tack tape to hold it into yeah. place just by anchoring it at the top yes. and then you can lift it up or oh. Uh, you can use the repositional spray, which is a fabulous spray. It's not going to damage your stencil either, and it's not going to leave any gluey marks um, onto your uh, card project or your canvas if you were doing this onto a canvas. Do you wash these after every use as well? Your yes, stencils? yep, I would. If you, especially if you're using your texture paste, warm soapy water, inks, you can wipe them down, or you can create what I call a tufa oh, by right. taking a trufa because there's lots of ink still left on there ah. so I could take another piece of cardstock and run that back over the top ah, yes. but look how beautiful this, this is, is already layering up so I'm going to go in with the last one Ben and I'm going in with the um, this time this is the plum jam Ooh, and yes. exactly the same I'm just going to hanker that down just over the edge and then you're going to see just how fabulous this is and then we'll pop it on a card and I'll show you it again uh, I mean really these could be called creator cards as well because they're so mm. so easy to use um, Shannon, super easy Shannon on YouTube says I have a question can you use the sparkle pens and pots doing these sparkle pens yeah. to color in you mm. could do if you want it's going to be a bit fiddly yeah um and, and if you were using your liquid inks the things is is it could it could seep underneath yeah so i would probably stick to things like your inks uh, you could take your spray your sparkle spray Ooh, over yes. the top so now i could just finish this off by popping a piece of um you know spraying the sparkle thing through spraying sparkle, sparkle yeah but again well, look how fabulous are you knocking things down again ben do you know what i haven't done it for what about are you a week. Like? And that's two, two times about five minutes. Go on, oh, carry on. bless you. So that is now all that design done. And it looks absolutely sensational. All that I've done with this one, I've just wow. took my tape off for a second and hold that up so you can see it. But I'll show you the one that I've done. Oh, let me just hold that down there for you. What I'm just going to do now, Ben, I've just taken, this is one I did last night in my craft room. Yeah. All I've done is distressed oh, around yes. the edges. So I brought that in the frame. So I just went back over with my pink tulip and literally just did this all the way around the edge to give a nice little distressed look. Um, I'm going to pop it in though into our lovely little Brenda because I'm going to use... Got Brent, I've got Brenda today. Not she's not been out for a while. She hasn't been out for ages. Well, I've got my Debbie at home because I've got a Debbie. Oh, yeah, I've the Debbie 2.0. Debbie. I have. Debbie 2.0. I was here the day yeah. that Liam made that Absolutely. for you. Absolutely. I love her. I use her all the time. Uh, but I thought I'd use Brenda because Brenda should have the star in roll up yes. here in, in the graph. But again, just going to use our spray. Now, this is a, a glitter varnish. And this one is the... Per it's it's a, absolutely my favourite. 
Pearl Diamond. Is Pearl Diamond on the show? Pearl Diamond, yeah, we've got on the show. We've also Good got job. the silver and the gold. I notice you're spraying it from a bit, like you're giving it a little burst as opposed yes. to like a big spray. Have you noticed I'm not going in close? Yeah, as well. If you go in close, yeah. you're probably going to get too much. It'll be like, it'll, it'll, it'll be too Over much. Overglitified. Yes. And so what you do is you lift it up. So if I, if I could just have a little visual above here. Just oh, so look at directing you. now. Look at this. I know me. I'm getting a bit of directing. No. Shouting, <laughs> shouting at me, Mia. They'll be like, Debbie, leave that bit to me. But you literally, you just spray. A little spray it's just over the top ah, and yes. let that fall on and it disperses more evenly if you go too close Ben and you go too close you'll probably get too much there so right. the best way to do it is hold your hand up oh sorry Brenda <coughs> oh, she, dear. she's lost the bottom oh. uh, I'm just going to bring that in don't know if you can pick up that sparkle on, give it a it's a very beautiful yes. subtle sparkle pearl diamond is absolutely one of my favorites but this is a varnish so you let it dry and i say let it dry you won't have to leave it that long ben because no. it is pretty instant uh, but i'm just gonna now let me just uh where's my wet glue there we go let me just bring in my uh glue and i'm just going to show you again i've already done a little bit of matting and layering on an eight by eight card i trimmed this down slightly but that just fits perfectly into there i'm going to let that just uh, rest there but i'm just going to finish that off now with a little bow oh what did you do with your bow debbie oh, did I? let me bring in my bow and my bring glue your, gun yeah, oh, yeah. and i'm just going to finish that off a blob of glue or a, what does that sarah call it globule a globule globule of a a What's wrong of, with me today? A globule of glue. A globule of glue. <laughs> and there you go. Gorge. Now you can create a beautiful design and an instant card in an instant. These are fabulous. The layering stencils. But I'm just going to say this right now. All seriousness, I genuinely thought that was the price of one. So to get all four designs, that's... Tw is that 16 cents? No, 3, 6, 9, 12 stencils. Yes. I'm so sorry, maths weren't one of my strong points. 12 stencils for, it's a less than a pound a stencil. Yeah. Then. That's insane. Yeah. You wouldn't be able to get an 8x8 stencil for less than a pound yeah. anywhere. These are fabulous and they are absolutely gorgeous. Going to create some brilliant designs. Very quick, simple designs. But you can have fun with all your things like your texture pastes, your inks and all those kind of things incredible incredible uh, this is the chat as well at the minute on the um on the socials uh shadaya saying really happy that you're demoing those stencils i have those and never used them uh, but that price is a giveaway get using them seriously the stencils are unbelievable um who else has commented oh yeah diana saying loving the look of the stencils gotta grab them danny you've got to do it uh, and shannon says thank you jb for answering my question shannon that is what we are here for don't you worry about that uh, but yeah Honestly, you talk about value for money with these, phenomenal, $11.98. They're normally, as I said, $9.99 each. So it's, it's basically like you're paying for one and then you're paying $1.99 for the other three. That's how I kind of compute it. And that makes me go, that's a heck of a buy. French Vine, City Skyline, Carte Postale and Postmark Paris for $11.98. I mean, again, if you're thinking to yourself, well, uh, maybe I only use a couple, get the whole collection, keep a couple for yourself, and then you can give a couple away as presents. Christmas will be here before you know it. That's a huge deal. Um, also proving really popular, uh, the Spray and Sparkle. So we saw this just a few moments ago with uh, Debbie. We've got um, a brilliant collection here, the three-piece collection. We don't often see this, I'm being told, on um, uh, Crafters TV. So get it whilst it is here. So you're going to get your gold, you're going to get the silver and the, uh, the pearl diamond. Uh, that Debbie was just mentioning a few moments ago. So your gloss varnish here, and it's got that really ultra fine glitter in it to just add that kind of a bit of uh, a bit of oomph to your projects, a bit of sparkle, a bit of glitz, a bit of glam. Uh, that is what you need. Thirteen ninety eight. Here's the thing. You may well have noticed these are new, but I, when I dropped them, the the lid came, and I don't want to. That one there looks upside. My directors go, have you broken them? Yeah, I I'm sorry, I did. And I don't want to, I don't want to open them because they're still. You'll get to ones that aren't broken. Apologies. Right, uh, next up. Now, this is amazing. Now, uh, Debbie has forgotten her tote bag today. Thankfully, though, I have got mine here. 
the Ultimate Crafting uh, seven piece bundle. Now this, again, is a super, super deal because pretty much you've got everything that you need in this bundle, all right? So you're gonna get this amazing tote bag. Perfect for all your crafty goodies. Yeah, you always think about this for like transporting bits and pieces from place to place, but actually, um, it's great just actually to keep everything in place. And if you haven't got a lot of room at home and you've got bits lying all over the place, there's plenty of room here. And in the words of one of my friends here at Crafters TV, Leanne, this is capacious. <laughs> now, uh, capacious for the fact that you've got a huge amount of room in the, uh, in the um, main compartment, if you like. So nice and deep, plenty of room. I I'll show you those bits and pieces in a second because those are little freebies that you're getting with this kit. Uh, and around the outside, around the outside, around the outside, you've got uh, loads of pockets for, I mean, whatever you want to put in there, really. Nice, deep pockets. You've got uh, two on the front, two on the back, one on either side. Then you've got your hook and mesh system on the handle here as well. So you can make sure that if you are carrying, because let's be honest, when you fill this up, it's going to get heavy. You want to make sure it's not cussing into your fingers. You've got that. Now, not just the bag for 45, 46. Oh no, friends, you're gonna get goodies. So we are throwing in, I mean, I'm not throwing them in because that would be dangerous, but you're getting these scissors. They are included within this uh, amazing deal. You've then also got in here, what's in the little side pocket here? Oh yeah, your low tack tape. Very, very handy to have, and it comes on the rolls for you as well. That's included. I tell you what, Get the stencils as well, and you've got your low-tack tape to keep your stencils in place, and you won't have to risk it for a biscuit like our, our Debbie Robinson. Uh, you're also going to get, oh yes, the precision tweezers as well. How often have you wished you had a pair of tweezers available? You've got your flat end tip, your straight point tip, your angle point tip, and your needle point tip, all included for all of those craft. Who, who knew there were so many types of tweezers? Well, now you know. Now, not only that, we are also giving you, and it works out that you're getting these for free, Pokey tools. Handy? I think so. Two pokey tools in this kit. Also in here, you're gonna get your glue, your tacky glue. Never wanna run out of that bad boy. That's included in here too. And also, sorry, I'm just counting. Uh, your fine tip glue applicator as well. Really handy for those more precision projects. Now this is this is a seven piece bundle, but if you look at it, like, there's two items there, two items there, that's four. That's five, there's four there, which is nine, that's 10. There's three items there, which is 13. Your bag, which is 14. It's 14 items, really, for 45, 46. That's a brilliant buy. You've got so much included in there, as I've said. You've got the tote bag itself. It's even got a hard bottom as well. It's nice to have a nice hard bottom, isn't it? To make sure that uh, everything is, oh, by the way, just show you the bottom. I know this is very important. The bottom, you've got the little studs there as well. So if you are popping this down, you've got the bottom protected. All included for that price is phenomenal. Right, next up. Now, won't lie, will not lie to you. This next collection <laughs> was Debbie's favorite, but then she saw the uh, stencil collection and she changed her mind. So I don't know whether these are now joint favorites or whether these are kind of, you know, this is the second favorite. I'm not quite sure. We know that Debbie loves her butterflies. Uh, so let's just say that I think this collection is kind of a joint favorite on the show. This is the Nature, Nature's, Nature's Garden Beautiful Butterflies Cartload Collection. Now, within this, you are gonna get your 3D embossing folder with your majestic butterflies. You've got uh, dies which include your intricate trellis, your floral border, uh, and your lace frame. Then you've got two stamp and die collections, which is Butterfly Dreams and Rose Bloom. And then you've got your, um, your clear acrylic stamp, which is just to say, normally you'd be getting this home for $76.93 or $125.77. It's a half price deal for everybody. £38, $62. It really is wonderful. I've just got um, one little board here to show you, which is the uh, which is the stamps um, that you're going to get included with this as well. But we'll go over to Debbie and uh, see all of this and um, see some uh, demos as well. Because I tell you what, what really is going to sell this to you is when you see some of the things that you can make. And the first thing that Debbie's got in her hands is beautiful. Look at this. Oh, it's absolutely gorgeous. Lovely home decor pieces as well. Now, everybody who knows me knows that I absolutely love butterflies. 
This collection is one of my favourites, Ben. I'm not going to lie, it's absolutely gorgeous. But you can make in things like this. One of this is just from the Butterfly Dream set that's been added onto um, onto a, like a wreath shape. It's absolutely love gorgeous. Idea. I love that idea. But there's so many ways that you can use these into your different style kind of cards. So like your easel cards, and there's two of those beautiful frames on there in the background and used as a stopper. Um, absolutely beautiful. There's that gorgeous stamp set in there as well. There really is some fabulous, fabulous ways that you can create them. And again, I mean, look at this. Those nesting dies that I add on. This is what you could be doing um, at the beginning of the week. Love this it. is what you could be doing with the with these designs and just using certain elements from them. Whether you use papers, adding the stamps on. Um, uh, honestly, Ben, these are absolutely incredible, and I love them. I think they're fabulous. There's so many ways that you can use this collection. It's a cracking price as well. Uh, but this is the one that I'm going to start with tonight, which is that beautiful oh, wow. butterfly dream set. That's just one element from the whole of that kit at that fabulous price and again honestly Ben this like I said it's the only limit is your imagination one of my favorite sayings that I've been saying a lot recently but it's yeah. true it, it really is true we're giving you the tools you can create your heart's content in however colorful you want it to be how muted it want you want them to be it just is phenomenal but I'm just going to show you like I said this is just one element out of that kit Ben which is the butterfly dreams and it is absolutely beautiful it's a set of butterfly stamps and i'll just turn them over you can see how well i'm going to show you something now you can see how well loved mine are whoa well if i just pop this down there yes. for a second and you look overhead <laughs> they're yeah. absolutely filthy my stamps and i'm going to make no apologies because <laughs> i use these stamps ever such a lot uh, and i use them with all sorts of different colors but honestly i love them and then you get a set of dies that you can use to create as well so the dies themselves have every single so this one two three four five and then you get the five different uh, matching set of dies to fit over the stamps oh debbie and her words today what is wrong I with me i wouldn't worry about it it's, <laughs> Just... I was, oh there's me going i was about to go it's friday so it's been a busy week it's not even friday is it I think what you're going to be like this time tomorrow when me and you are working together. You're going to be able to get a single word out, Oh dear, I know, yeah, I'm coming up to do another show. So what I'm just going to show you, I'm going to fast forward the stamping yes. stage. Uh, because we, you know, you've, you've seen us stamp many a time, but you just take one of your stamping platforms, whether it be an 8x8, and if you do your 8x8, you can put all these stamps on in, in one go. But what I want to show you is how they actually work and fit over. Now, I'm not going to sit here and spend loads of time colouring, but what I am going to show you is how easy they are to use oh, yeah. and line up. So you would colour them in, Ben, and then you would take your die and use a bit of low-tack tape to hold it down into place. And each one of these has its own set of uh, dies. So it's got its own set of dies that you just layer up across each one. Now you can see I've gone a little bit mad and I've actually stamped quite a right. fair few more than I should have done. However, this is just showing you what you can do. Now, you literally just... Debbie, come on, line yourself up. Am I, <laughs> oh, what oh, is wrong? On. Hang on a minute. Don't know why. What? That's not that die. It's What's one that? of these. It's all right, Ben. It's all right. I was doing these late last night in my craft room, so it's my own fault. I should have labelled them up. Uh, but I've just used four, four of them. Four will do. Four will do. And we're just going to line that up, pop that across, and then run this through. And each one of these will have cut out their own separate butterfly as well. So let's bring back in the smaller plate. Because these will fit through, in fact, these will all fit through your really small machines as well. They're going to fit through um, from your largest machine right down to your little Gemini Mini as well. So you can be rest assured all of those dies from that one, one element of that, di uh, that die kit is going to fit through your small machines too. So when I pop that through and you release those, you've now got a set of beautiful butterflies that have been cut out precision. You're not having to mess about fancy cutting them. Yeah. You've got each one cut out that fits perfectly over that stamp. And I just think they're absolutely fabulous. And then you can get your colouring materials, whether it, whatever it is you want to colour them with, Ben, because you can colour your stamps in with watercolours, with sparkle pens, with any of your um, classics Ooh, or yeah. your illustrators or anything else. But then you've got all your dies that have cut those out. And when you colour them in, Ben, and literally, this is one what's coloured in. Love so that's the largest colors one. You've used there. Thank you very much. I've just used uh, bright colours for this, Ben. Like I wanted it to go party. really bright. In fact, I actually used my tri blends. These are my tri blends that I've used. Mm. So again, you can see now each one of these 
have got their own set of butterflies and once they've coloured in look at the difference absolutely fabulous amazing oh what was that producer Laura yeah try blends were on the earlier show we had them on with um fiona a little bit earlier on so check those out we had a good deal on those didn't we i'm trying to remember what it was 20 percent off the six packs when you use the code spectrum 20 at checkout there you go so have a look back right then so let's put this all together now so what i've done is i've created myself a little bit of an inky background so i've got a piece of white stamping card folded that half in half and cut that down let me just give you the right size so you know so i've cut that to seven by five yeah i've done myself myself like i said a little bit of an inky background no, but what i have nice. actually done that's just a uh, lemon tonic fuchsia and parakeet gin and to tonic. create that background and a little bit of um a bit did you, what did you think i said producer laura gin and tonic was it no no no, no lemon tonic oh, oh is lemon. it you ben i thought, I thought it was you said producer. gin and tonic i thought it was producer laura i know she likes it i know she likes a gin now and again <laughs> yeah. now and again ben. <laughs> Only at the weekends. <laughs> Only at the weekends, yeah. of course. Uh, but yeah, that's all it is. It literally is all that. I've just rubbed, and, I, and when I say I've just popped them onto some white card, yeah. I literally have popped them onto a white card and done a little bit of a fake, fake bleach technique by splashing a bit of water on. Love it. But I've taken some acetate. Now I've gone a little bit larger than my seven, uh, seven inches because I want to have a bit of a dome feature. So I've actually just cut this uh, a couple of inches bigger and scored half an inch line down either side and put some tape on there. Because what I'm going to do is before I stick it onto my base, I'm going to actually wrap it round this decorative panel so i'm just going to lift off my tape both sides take that off lift it around and then we're going to have fun creating and like i said this is just one element from that beautiful kit that butterfly kit is one of my favorites i don't think i'll ever ever never stop using it <laughs> because it's just got a beautiful selection of things in there yeah and again that's just now created my dome feature i've got a dome here and oh, then i'm going to stick that on to my base let me just find me glue gun there just for a second not glue gun your tape, tape pen, pen debbie tape that's pen it. so pop that across and that's going to stick onto my base of my card and then we're going to have a little bit of fun just by popping a bit of hot glue over the acetate and sticking my butterflies on in various places. Love that. Well, whilst you're sticking, there's so many lovely, lovely messages coming in today uh, from uh, from everybody. Um, oh, I've got. I must tell you that code that we had, uh, Spectrum Twenty, is finished. Apparently. Mm, sorry about oh, that. Oh no. That's what it says. It just had a message flash up saying that code is finished. My bad. Sorry. Let me just. Sorry. Um, just want to say some lovely messages coming in. Uh, Lynn Harvey on Facebook says, Debbie, you're what you like, saying, <laughs> I now use when children in my class do something a little clumsy. I heard myself a few times just today <laughs> saying things like, oh dear, what you like. <laughs> um, reference those uh, sprays that we've got. Stacey says, I have them all and they're fab. I love, love, love the spray and sparkle. Uh, Shadia says, read the tote bag, which you got on the show. Uh, the tote bag is capacious. That is the home for my mini and every other tiny mini dies. And Gilmore says, OMG, Ben, you use Leanne's word, capacious. I know, I, I won't forget that word now because it's such a cool word. Um, what Carol does says, it mean though, Ben? Capacious, uh, well, let me tell you. Capacious means massive. Oh, because it means it's. I, I just think of it like I think of spacious and capacity. That's how I remember it. So it's capacity spacious, isn't it? Capacious. Ah, oh, now you see. It, it, is it is it a real word or is it a Leanne word? Oh no, it's a real word, isn't is it? Is it really? Oh, please don't tell me it's a made up word. <laughs> Please we need don't to tell work. me. It's a bit like being on Countdown, isn't it? We need one of those Countdown adjudicators uh, to, to work out whether or not <laughs> it's a real word corner. or not. It is a real <gasps> oh, we've just been told it is a yes. real word. <laughs> it is a real word. I should always believe in our lovely Leanne. I would know that our Leanne tells the truth with absolutely everything. So I know that that's a proper word. Absolutely. But talking of look, can we just go? Let me just take a moment. How gorgeous is that butterfly greens? And that's just one element that you can create using in this with some inks stamp and uh, literally can you see now that beautiful shape where you just lift those off just by adding a little bit of acetate you can see what you can create which is really really fabulous i love them They're um, absolutely fab and says love this effect the butterflies are flying what's that called the home of the home of a butterfly what well you know you've got butterflies in there is it it's not an apiary is it is that no 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 but what's it called like a butterfly isn't there a name for it isn't there like you have like an aviary for birds What's it called for butterflies, or am I making this up? House? Not called a house. Well, got... there's butterfly houses. No. I know there's butterfly houses. It's called a. It's called a. 
Is it an apiary or is that bees? Bees is an apiary, isn't it? Um, I'm sure it is. Um, lots of people love the butterflies anyway. D Dances with Pam on YouTube says, I love the butterflies. Uh, Bernice saying, hello everyone. I love this show. I never miss a cartload. Uh, and uh, Denise says, the CC team are such beautiful people. They make my heart happy. Now, I must apologize to my learned friend and colleague over the other side of the studio because apparently uh, the home of a butterfly is called... A house. Thank you, thank you. You see, I sometimes do have some knowledge up in the head of mine. And our lovely, lovely director as well. He said the same thing. We said it at the same time we did. So yes, Ben. <laughs> anyway, uh, if you'd like to get your hands on this uh, butterfly collection, maybe you want to make your own butterfly house. <laughs> Um, we have that available for you. So uh, this collection includes your amazing 3D embossing folder. You're going to get three dies in here as well. So you've got your intricate trellis, you've got your uh, intricate floral border included, you've got your intricate lace frame and your uh, butterfly dream stamp and die set. You've then got your rose bloom stamp and die set. And then you've got your uh, just to say um, as well. It is absolutely beautiful. Um, and, and it is flying out of here, it's, excuse, the, excuse the pun. Uh, £38 or $62, it's a half price deal. Um, Melissa on Facebook saying, my mum would have loved that card, uh, both to make it or receive it. She loves butterflies and bright colours. It is absolutely stunning, really, really beautiful. Um, I'll tell you what lots of you are also commenting on, uh, on the socials is the autumn card pack or the fall card pack um, as our um, American friends are calling it because yeah I always forget it's autumn and fall isn't it over there I really love this and the reason why um, you're going for this I believe is because a the price uh, b the multi buy bundle deal and c three reasons uh, well I mean look at the colour palette you've got you so you've got a mixture of um, cardstock and paper in here different weights as you go through but you've got this beautiful cardstock with that little bit of a sheen on it but look at these colours absolutely beautiful and perfect because we've just nonchalantly rolled into October so you've got your autumnal colours that you want colours like this I mean you could absolutely use for your Christmas projects as you could um, you know, well, yeah, you've got spring in here, I suppose, as well. But that sort of goldy effect you could use for Christmas too. I mean, really, we call it a, an autumn card pack. But actually, you have got colours for all times of the year. But definitely, those kind of uh, darker colours, the more sort of uh, autumnal colours you're going to be using in your projects now as well. So you're getting uh, 50 sheets of cardstock, 50 sheets of the paper as well, 5 99 or $9.99, uh, or two for a tenner, or two for $16. That's a very, very popular selection today. Right, we are officially over halfway on cartload already. So let's recap on what we got left, because I tell you what, you are, you are obliterating the stock that we've got. Now, the creator card, we had loads of the different um, designs of this, but already uh, it's flying out, it's flying out. So we've sold out of a load. We have still got the sweet treats, which is the cupcake, but that is now uh, limited stock. There's green on the screen, which means it soon won't be seen. Thanks, Debbie. <laughs> no, um, so uh, 17 pounds or $23 for the uh, sweet treats. Is that the only one we've got left in that collection? Oh, okay, we have still got, which is the other one that we had? Uh, the dress, be fabulous. We've still got that available for you. Now, something else which is proving very, very popular indeed is this um, 3D layering stencil collection. You want to talk about, you want to talk about uh, value for money? Well, this is off the chart. You're going to get the four piece stencil collection, the 3D layering stencil collection. It's amazing. And you saw the demo that um, Debbie did earlier on with the carte postale, which you get with this. But theoretically, you're getting 12 different stencils for $11.98, and when I tell you that normally these are $9.99 each, you work that out, you work that out. You're paying an extra, what, £1.99 for three more of the kits. This should be nearly 40 quid. You're getting it for $11.98. Should be nearly 47, or it should be 47.80. You're getting it for $14.34. Massive saving there, and go for it. How much fun can you have with those stencils for your card making, for your home decor? Now, even like um, Debbie was saying, using them to decorate your kitchen. I mean, you might want to do that, but at that price, please don't miss out on that deal. Now, the uh, Ditto Tool Tote, 
We showed you that earlier on, really good bit of kit for uh, carrying things here, there and everywhere and getting everything in check. The pink sold out, the turquoise is now limited. Uh, we do still have a lot of the black available for you though, but if you wanna get that in your basket, £20.79 or £19.99. Now, also proving really popular, the uh, Gemini stamp and die collection. So again, you remember at the top of the show, uh, the we had loads of sellouts here. The poinsettia is limited now. Um, so grab that before it goes, three pounds or four dollars. I have a feeling that we had more of those, so whether they sold out or not, I'm not quite sure, uh, but things are flying out of the door. Right, we're gonna go onto the shaker cards in just a second. Um, the paper pack, by the way, loads of you loving. Details on the screen here. Michelle on uh, YouTube says, uh, love the colours in this paper pack. I'm waiting for mine to arrive. And there's a bit of chat going on now about the butterfly houses. You see, I knew, I knew. Uh, Dieter <laughs> on YouTube says, a butterfly house, garden or farm is an enclosed butterfly habitat where hundreds of different butterfly species live and breed in a very natural yet controlled environment. That's good. Now this one from Astrid uh, on Facebook says, According to Google McGoogle Face, I think that's just Google, a butterfly's home. Yeah, yeah, see? See? A butterfly's home, because if you collect, like people who collect butterflies are called lepidopterists, aren't they? It's lepidoptery is butterflies. So apparently a butterfly's home is called a, called a lepidop <laughs> lepido lepidopterarium. It's not, I, I, it's true, it's not a wind up. A lepidopterarium. Because you have an aquarium for fish, you have a, Something arium for something else. <laughs> and you have a lepidop, lep, lepidopterarium for butterflies. Thank you. I knew it wasn't called a house. Yes, it is. Lepidop, <laughs> lepidopterarium. Right. Uh, shaker cards. Shaker card. Um, I, I can show you the two that we've got here available for you. Lepidopterarium. Uh, right. So the shaker cards. This is a little shaker card duo for you, all right? So you've got your um, shaker card cocktails and love always. So we'll show you the cocktail one first of all. So this is really cool because you're gonna get um, your metal die set and then you're also going to get your um, stamps included as well. I love the stamps with this. Uh, let's get tipsy. Uh, if life gives you limes, make cocktails uh, and congratulations. So you've got everything that you need. Um, and these coordinate together, obviously, and then you use your main die to, to, to kind of create the aperture, and then you can add your acetate, and then you pop in your shaker bits, so your beads, your sequins, um, what, not beans, beads, your little beads. I mean, you could put beans in there, I suppose, if you want. Rice in there, I suppose you could put in if you want. And what else could you put in there to use as? Coloured salt. What? Coloured salt. Coloured salt you could put in there. Um, I mean, whatever you like, really. So you've got your cocktails, and then this is your love. So again, exactly the same. You've got your beautiful um, love die set, the metal die set, and then all the stamps in there included as well. So things like bundle of, um, sent with, uh, at first sight, you forever, in the is in the air, always, I love you, happy ever after. So really cool. I don't think I've seen one of these in action before, so we will have a look at them with um, Debbie in just a few moments time. So 11 pounds or 15.50, 60% off. Um, so deals galore here. If you like a shaker card, you like your cocktails and you love a bit of love, you're gonna want this collection. Uh, let's go into our Debbie, who's the other side of the studio. What you got for us? Well, I'll tell you why you want it, Ben. Look at the price. Look at that price. I know, right? For two of these dies that are gonna create, again, some fun cards. They really should, well, they should be from the creator card range because they do create a beautiful card, a fun card as well. And I love a good shaker card, Ben. Very on trend, still now. I can see you shaking. <laughs> I can still, honestly, they're a fun card, a very on trend card as well. There you go, yeah. But honestly, they're absolutely fabulous. And these are made with ease because we've done all the hard work for you. You're gonna have that fun again just by creating them so this is a couple of samples that i've got to show you i mean that's a treble treble shaker card there oh, it's wow. absolutely fabulous one that's acted as a stopper so it's literally lifted off there and two that are sunk in which i think is absolutely fabulous these are the fun parts that you're going to be able to create and you can be as dramatic as you want with your beautiful colors there your red and your golds absolutely incredible you can pop whatever you want in these shaker cards as well love a good cocktail ben i don't know about you but i love a good cocktail Do you look at this you can put beads in there as yeah. well or beans or, be or beans yeah, 
have a cocktail if I'm on holiday? Not something I drink in this country. Really? No, oh, on my birthday, I definitely have a cocktail oh, yeah. or two. Ooh. Definitely. But yeah. again, look how fabulous they are. And these are fantastic and super, super easy to use as well. So I'm going to use this gorgeous Love Always. I love the fact that you don't have to choose because you're getting both of them For in that price quid. again. Yeah. Absolutely fabulous. And they're a little bit... Do you know what I talked about earlier with the Creator card? They're a little bit thicker than a normal standard mm. thin die. It's because you can cut through multiple layers of cardstock and things like heavyweight acetate. So I've been using heavyweight acetate throughout my demos that I've used that butterfly one. I know somebody asked me about that. Um, I used heavyweight acetate, which you can find on, uh, we do it in a pack of A3 size, but we also do a pack of heavyweight, um, and I think it's in a smaller size as well. Just go and check the website out and you'll find the acetate on there as Good well eye. so yes these are made from a thicker die so you can cut through multiple layers at any one time but to create that beautiful shaker element first there's a couple of things you need to do so i'm going to just first of all going to use the two outer well say the two parts the two main parts that's going to create that frame now again this is something you can do in one failed swoop if you want or you can do it in two parts so by that you could cut that through and then run that through uh, once you've created your full shape. However, I'm going to risk it for a biscuit again. <laughs> is that your new saying today? It I've is my new saying that today. Yeah, it is my saying it. today risk because it uh, I'm just going to pop that through and do it all at the same time. But it's because Ooh. we've got good dies though as yes. well, Ben, and a great machine with our Gemini. Because this is um, a die again, we're just going to run through the normal die combination and it's going to cut that beautiful frame out. Then I'm going to cut some acetate and then I'm going to create a little bit of background piece as well. And there's other, other features on this one as well, Ben. You've got a beautiful love design. You've also got some love hearts as well mm. on here that you can create. You could create your own shakers with these because you could cut those out multiple times oh, put and put those in there. Absolutely. And then you've got a lovely set of stamps that you can customise what you want to say. So bundle of love, uh, scent with love, love always, I love you, um, happily, oh, I love that, happy ever after, love is in the air, love you forever and love at first sight. Aww. There's even some lovely kisses. A lot of love That's today. definitely true today, and it is. It's a beautiful saying that one. I love that one. But again, this is um, I've used a, a glitter cardstock for this, Ben, to show you again what kind of materials this can cut through. So I've got a lovely heart that I'm going to keep to one side. But what that's done is created, and it's got a beautiful stitch design on this one. There's a gorgeous stitch design around the outside as well. That's going to be the front part of my shaker. Yeah. But I'm not done, Ben, oh. because I'm I'm going to now cut through some acetate. So yes. I've got some acetate here and some. Oh, what have I done with my acetate? Oh, it's that invisible stuff. It's there, isn't it? Got it. Wow. Got it. I've got acetate oh. and my. Um, and my white stamping card, ah. but the acetate, heavyweight acetate as well. What I would just recommend is you pop your metal shim in when it's heavyweight acetate, just to pop that through. But I'm creating from the larger die, I'm actually popping the, uh, the large die on the acetate because if you do it with a smaller one, it's not going to fit over there clearly. It's going to sink straight through. So you need it to be the large die to create that back. Uh, that will stick to that frame. Does that make sense, Ben? Yes. I hope it did, because when I was saying it out loud, it didn't make sense to me. Oh, it does make sense. Well, yeah, we can hear the crunch. That's oh, the crunch. You that's know it's working. That's isn't it? Oh, it is a satisfying. I Ooh. love that crunchy sound. Really nice sound it is. crunch. crunch. A crunch. And that's because I've put my metal shim in there. So I know that this one will have cut through absolutely beautifully. I'm just going to lift my tape off. Oh, I don't know what I was worrying about there. No need to worry, Debbie, although I've put too much tape on. Uh, pop that there, and now you've got, I don't know if you can see it there. Can you see it in my hand? Almost invisible. Oh, Ooh, yeah. there, there you go. go. There we've created that, and that will fit perfectly over ah, yes. the top of the frame, rather than if you did use the smaller one, it would have sunk through there. Now, I'm going to speed it up a little bit, but what I've actually done is cut out another large frame, just solid this time, because that's going to act as the back. And when we stick these all together, and if we just move this to one side for a second, let me pop those back on there. What you're going to do is you're going to stick your acetate to the back of your frame. So use things like, um, I would use probably our strong tape. Okay. I think that's probably the best one to do. Use our strong tape or um, low tacky, uh, not low tacky tape, tacky, tacky glue, tacky glue, that's the word. Tacky glue, not wet glue. And there's a reason why I wouldn't use wet glue. 
uh, I wouldn't use a wet glue Ben because the wet glue will seep out and it'll slip a little bit too too much around there if that makes sense yes so what you're going to do is pop that onto there and then you're going to take some foam on a roll now we do this in uh, it'll be on the website as well so check the website out and you're going to and it fits perfectly our foam on a roll because it just fits perfectly around the edge and that's how you will create um the solid because you need this to be solid so again don't use things like foam pads if you're going to use foam pads you're going to have to put them side by side uh, to make sure there's no gaps because if you've got a gap ben yes what's going to seep through the gap then whatever's in the shaker exactly the beans exactly so you don't want that and that's now created that and then all you're going to do is take that off the top so let's just find Pokey Tool again. Here we go. That's a good bit of chat whilst you're just sticking that because, well, Molly Hannah on YouTube says, shake a card, shake a card. <laughs> Where's Joe singing? Well, I can't do Joe, but that was my singing for you. I hope that was fine. Uh, but LJ on Facebook says, I love shaker cards, but I don't often make them because I usually end up fighting with the sequins. Now, if, if, if other people are watching right now and they fight with the sequins, what, what's easiest to put in a shaker card that you're not going to end up fighting if with? If you're going to fight with sequins, I would use things like gems. So just gems are really fabulous and just push them into the middle. So it depends on how many you want. I mean, I'm using sequins for this one. I know mm. what she means by that. Because sometimes they stick everywhere, you can, don't they? They do, they get everywhere sequins. However, the little top tip that I would do is push them into the middle yeah. and have this lined up ready. Yes. You could put some wet, this is when you could put your wet glue around there uh, just to give you a bit of time to get it into place. Because I, I think I know what she means when she says she fights with it. Sometimes if you've got them close together, <laughs> what can happen is these sequins start sticking under that tape mm. and get absolutely everywhere. I've had it happen to me before, live on hair as well, so I totally feel your pain there. But the best way is push them all into the middle and then literally pop that over the top. Or you could put them into the middle of here and then place your base. When I mean the base, pop that over the top of it and seal it over the top so that that way you're not having to fight with anything. I hope that helped and made a little bit of sense as well. So that now is my shaker all made. Yeah. So what we're going to do, Ben, is we're going to decorate a card. Whoop, whoop. So what I've just done with this one is I've taken some more um, of the... This is our luxury... Do you know from the purple... Um, Purple, ba uh, purple batch? Yeah, purple batch. This is from the purple luxury glitter cardstock that has the mirror card in there and it also has the matte mirror. And I'm just going to place that just onto the top, centralise that, and then... I'm just thinking, where's that come from? There we go. I've actually taken a piece of cardstock and used those small love hearts that uh, I was talking yeah. about. Uh -huh. I've just popped them in top corner. Love it. And that just cuts through and it gives me a nice little bit of um, a shape there as well, mm. which I think is absolutely fab. I'm just going to pop some glue just on the back of that as well. Let's just take that all the way around. Some tape run out. Oh, I think... Uh-oh. Oh, well out. Uh-oh, we better get that fixed and remedied. Yeah, it's coming to the end. Oh. I can see the silver strip approaching. Let's just get the last little bits out there. <laughs> I can see the silver strip approaching. I can see it approaching. And I think I must have had some ink on my card because I've got some inky bits there. But never mind. I'm not going to worry too much. Uh, in fact, I'll tell you what. Debbie's got ink absolutely everywhere. <laughs> oh my goodness. And I thought I'd clean myself down. What, what am I a like? new line. Exactly. I'm going to use my waist. Let's pop our waist back down. I've stamped on your you forever. I'm going to pop this one on there now as well. So again, let's just run some tape on the back there. Well, Have that cool. over the top. And then lastly, that beautiful word love as well. I'm just going to literally take using my dotty tape pen and I'm going to seal that over the top there. So love you, Ben. Oh, I love you too. Forever. Oh, it's a card. Okay. And there yeah. you go. So a nice give quick a card again. Shall we give it a shake? Yeah. Shake a card. Shake a card. There you go. Absolutely fabulous. Um, really super easy to use. Fabulous price for two sets, not one, two. I, I love this. No, what a brilliant card. Just before we wrap up, and I'll give you the details again of your shaker card, one final question on this from Dieta, talking about things to put in your shaker card. Um, and you mentioned it earlier. Dieta says, How do you colour salt? Oh, so, Dieta, this what? Do you know when we do our salt techniques with um, our inks? So like our sparkle inks or aqua inks or all those kind of things where you do the coloured uh, salt technique, oh, yeah. where you throw your rock salt onto your colour and then yeah. you let it dry and then knock that off, you end up with beautiful ah. coloured salt. So I don't throw it away, I bag it all up. And then when it comes to shaker cards, I sprinkle it in and it acts as a fabulous shaker element and cheap as chips because you're not costing you anything because you've used it. It's, like, it's almost like recycling salt. 
so to speak. There you but go. absolutely fabulous. That's what I that's how you get coloured salt. Cheap as chips, just don't put it on your chips. Uh, now a third of this bundle has gone. Uh, we are not surprised. Uh, so you're going to get the um, amazing cocktail, uh, of course, with all of the uh, the metal dies in there and the stamps as well. I love that. Let's get tipsy, it says, um, which is brilliant. And you're also going to get that brilliant uh, love collection as well, which we just saw in De Debbie's last demo. Really busy on the website. Loads of people watching currently. Eleven pounds or fifteen fifty, over sixty percent off. You might be looking at the show and thinking to yourself, "Well, hang on a minute." I want to shop the show. How do I do that? Here's some more information. Check out your baskets. Hi, I'm Joe from Crafters TV, and I'm here to show you how you can grab the best deals and shop whilst you watch during our shows. So the best way to watch us is always on Crafters TV. Head on over to our homepage and go to Crafters TV. You can see all of our shows, offers, and even shop while you watch. Now if you want to get involved and comment along, head over to our Facebook page. Come say hello, ask us some questions and lol with us. Or you can watch us on YouTube. Simply head to our Crafters Companion YouTube channel. Got a smart TV? You can even airplay directly onto your big screen. We're constantly adding new and exciting shows to our schedule, so don't forget to check in. It's never been easier to have us in your living room. It's always fun here at Crafters TV, so come join us as we create every day. Wow, we've only got 40 minutes remaining. The time is absolutely flying by. The product is absolutely flying out of the door. Your carts are getting full. Your baskets are, uh, well, full to the brim, and I am not surprised. We just want to recap on a few items, uh, which we, I still got that cake there. I will eat that. Thank you, Producer Laura. Uh, we just want to recap. Just want to, oh, was it Sarah who left it, was it? Um, just want to recap on some of the most popular items. We've had so many sellouts, we've had so many things going limited stock as well. Uh, but these uh, creator cards are proving uber popular. We've only got two of the range still available for you. So this is your sweet treats, first of all. Really cool idea. So you can create a card straight out of that. So that, that is your card. You know, you can cut the shape out so you've got a card in the shape of a cupcake. You can obviously use these for your, um, you know, your mats and there's your toppers as well if you wanted to. But the whole point here is to have fun with your card shapes. If you're bored of your squares and your rectangles, uh, then these are absolutely brilliant. You then get um, your stamps to coordinate with it. I'll just show you the back there because you get all of the coordinating stamps to be able to put your cupcake together and then you get some really cool stamps like it's Cupcake O'Clock. Uh, you're the icing on the cupcake. Happy birthday uh, and birthday cupcakes don't have calories. Well, wish that was the truth. Uh, 17 pounds or $23 and you can create, I've only got one sample here, but what a great sample it is. Take a look at that. Yes, uh, that's kind of layering up your cupcake card. There's so many ways to be able to use these and that, for me, is an absolute winner. So if you like your sweet treats, 17 pounds or $23. And then we've also still got available this, which is beef fabulous. I really, really like this one as well. So again, you can create a card shape with this beautiful dress and then dress it up however you choose really because again you'll see on the back here you've got all of these different um, accompaniments you've got the shoes in there the bows the ties and all those kind of bits and pieces uh, to make that dress as fabulous as you want it to be and then you're also going to get your um, coordinating stamps included as well things like on there be fabulous it's your day shine bright you shall go to the ball uh, and I can't say I do without you. Ah, oh, will you be my bridesmaid? That's brilliant. I've never seen that before as a little sentiment for a card. Great idea, I love that. Uh, that is also included. And then again, you can see uh, some of the cards that you can make. So as you know, you saw a little bit earlier on, you can cut the card shape out and just add to it. This is very similar to the demo that um, Debbie did a little bit earlier on. But then if you wanted to, you can then of course, just use the shape uh, as a topper for your card, adding in some of those stamps and that beautiful sentiment on there as well. And then look at that, something a little bit different uh, with a bit more bling on there as well. Really love that, 17 pounds or $23, uh, saving 12 pounds at 98 or 16.98 if you're in the States. Those are the only two that we've got left in the credit card currently because the rest have sold out. Now, uh, other items on the show which you might want to go for, the gilding wax, always popular, uh, the Pebio gilding wax collection. Now you're going to get uh, three of the different colors here, uh, which are your king gold, 
your antique gold and your renaissance gold. We always chat about these because they're so, so super handy. And uh, yes, they are already 30 mil pots, but those pots last an absolute lifetime. Uh, 30 pounds or $42, saving 15%. Uh, again, stock levels on those, not huge. So if you want to make sure you get them, uh, pop them in your basket swiftly. Perfect, of course, your uh, gilding waxes, not only with all sorts of other bits and crafty goodies, but with embossing folders. These are gonna really make this, this collection stand out. Uh, and again, this is a super collection when you consider we're, what, just a few weeks away from Christmas now. Uh, this is your uh, th uh, five by seven embossing folder festive collection. So you're gonna get with this uh, your beautiful mistletoe. Then you've got um, a stunning holly wreath in there as well. You've got your joy to the world. You've got peace on earth. And then you've got this really stunning holly frame as well. Uh, there's a five by seven. And the price on that again, come on, 14 quid for all five or $22. Bargain, bargain. And let me just tell you, I mean, it's always the case here, I think, um, and that's why I, I love it at Crafters TV because, do you know what, if you were to walk into a crafting store, for example, chances are you just see the things hung up and you wouldn't be able to appreciate just how great they're gonna make your craft look and make your projects look. You saw these at the top of the show, and yes, you might have been thinking, well, the price is amazing, but do I really want these stencils in my life? Now you've seen the demo, we might have to come back to these before the end of the show, but when you saw the demo earlier on with uh, Debbie showing you the carte postale, these have flown out of the door. The 3D layering stencil collection, so you're gonna get actually 12 stencils in total. The city skyline is amazing. The French vine has got your, uh, your Beaujolais on there and your Merlot with that beautiful grapevine. You've got your carte postale, which is the one we saw earlier on with that gorgeous, uh, gorgeous um, post stamp on it. And then you've got your postmark Paris as well. So three different um, stencils within each collection, allowing you to build a real 3D project and as we've seen great for your cards great for your home decor i love the idea as well of just using these you know putting these up on your wall and you know painting with them spraying with them using your inks with these however you want to do it you can create some amazing amazing samples should be almost 40 pounds or 48 dollars it's 11.98 or 14.34 today. The way I have put this in my mind is that they're normally 9.99 each here in the UK, so you're paying 1.99 for the other three. I think that's an amazing deal, and that's why they're flying. Also proving very popular, Debbie's original favourite on the show, but then when she realised that all the stencils were well that price, uh, this quickly became her second favourite, even though she loves butterflies. But that last demo that we saw, the demo before last, with the beautiful butterflies is absolutely stunning. Uh, in the beautiful butterflies collection, uh, you are going to be receiving so many different bits and pieces, including the 3D embossing folder with majestic butterflies, uh, the dies, which are your trellis, your floral border, and your lace frame. You're then gonna get your stamp and dies, the beautiful uh, butterfly dreams and that rose bloom. And then you're gonna get the uh, stamp, which is just to say, it's a half price deal at 38 pounds or $62 should be uh, 76 pounds or 125 dollars big big savings to be had and just to go back to those stencils which we showed you a few moments ago bernie burnis bernie can't say it bernie burnsify on youtube says those are gorgeous stencils i have them and love them so there you go grab them whilst you can uh it is cartload so we're moving on swiftly because we've only got half an hour left and we're going to look at the uh, gemini foil uh, and cut collection these are Christmassy, right i've got to find them now uh here we go so, um, within this collection, you've got Christmas Blessing, wishing you all the happiness. You've also got Celebrate the Wonder of Christmas, Tis the Season to be Jolly, and some of the greatest gifts are family and friends. Some really, really beautiful sentiments. And of course, multi-uses with these as well for the fact that you can um, foil and cut with these at the same time. And once again, it was one of those deals where you actually think to yourself, really, that price, $16.97? Yep, you're gonna get all five of these. Uh, and just to recap again, uh, that one is uh, some of the greatest gifts uh, are family and friends. Yeah, only some. Uh, uh, also, uh, tis the season to be jolly. You're going to get celebrate the wonder of Christmas. And again, you're know, adding falling to your projects. How beautiful is it going to make them look and make them stand out? Wishing you uh, happiness. Uh, what's that one? Wishing you all the happiness uh, your holiday can hold. 
And then finally, uh, Christmas Blessing. So all of these you're gonna receive. I know these were very, very popular before the show actually, and they've proved to be um, just as popular. Now we're uh, heading through the show as well. 16.97 or 22.85 for those and uh, we are going to see them in action in just a few moments time just by the way if you are uh, you know thinking about asking a question or if there's anything particular that you want to see from the cartload show i know it's a busy show and i know we've got lots on and sometimes you might skip over stuff quickly then do get in touch uh, you can get us on facebook or youtube or uh, email studio at crafterscompanion.co.uk and uh, we will answer any questions that you just might have. So, Debbie, these um, stamp and uh, cut, foil and cut, stamp and Christmas stamp and cut, you know what they are. <laughs> it's a good job of doing it, <laughs> <laughs> No, these are fabulous. These create that lovely little finished touch to your foiling. Um, so if you already own a foil press, yeah. this is going to be absolutely a go-to for you. And again, is that for everything, Ben? Uh, yeah, 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 all, all, of them. all five, yeah. Oh, that yeah. is amazing. It's that finishing touch, it's that sentiment, and it's absolutely beautiful. Now you can use them in a multiple of ways. So you can just use it as a foiled sentiment, and you can see that beautiful foil sentiment there. But it has the ability to cut out as well. So right there in the very centre yeah. is that celebrate one with that beautiful foiling running all the way through it, but it cuts out as well. So if I just show you again on this one, so you can see there, it just cuts out the centre sentiment perfectly but foils it too and it's absolutely incredible and again you can foil onto lots of different mediums so things like acetate ribbons cardstock glitter cardstock uh let me think uh, materials yeah. you can you can foil onto cottons and leathers and vellums and the list goes on and on and on and on and it really does but again it's just a beautiful design and it's got that little finishing touch i just think they're incredible and again very very simple to use now you'll if you haven't got your foil press why not <laughs> is what i'm going to say <laughs> go and check out the website but if you have got your foil press but you've never got these i'm going to show you how easy they are to use you will need to revert to your manual this is what we call a foil stamp and cut however it's in that light gray now you're probably thinking what you're talking about debbie it's light gray for a reason because it comes in two parts and this is the bit that does the stamp Oh, let me just take that sellotape off. The last thing we want is sellotape. We're on a hot foil machine. Oh, yeah, I don't want that, yeah. So let me just remove that for a second. Uh, but that's the stamp part. This is the die cut part. But I'm not going to use them both together, Ben. I'm going to use them separately. So I'm going to just place this in. Now, you can see straight away in my hand, this is a small die and it's a foil stamp. The reason it's light grey, if it was a foil stamp and cut die, which I know we're calling it that, Ben, yeah. but it's the one that you can do both to. Right. So you can foil straight in, but you have the ability to cut out as well, which is why we've done it in the light grey, that, that foil stamps in. But by bringing this part in, using your Gemini, you're going to be able to cut that out as well. So I'll, I'll just pop that to one side. And again, we're going to reference the foil stamp dies. I've already got my machine switched on. It's already, it's green, which means it's go. Uh, and again, it only needs a very small amount of temperature for this. It says 10 seconds on 300 GSM cardstock, which is what I've got here in my black. And I've actually been a bit generous because I've filled it up for the whole size. However, I'm only going to use a fraction of it. So I'm going to place that down on there. I've, I'm going to set it to 10 seconds seconds which is just on here up to 10 seconds i'm going to cover that over and that retains my heat and i'm going to press that start button in the meantime you get your foil all ready which is i've cut a couple of pieces out here all ready to show you you're going to wait for that countdown to count down and go beep i'm ready <laughs> so i love liliana always says and then all you're going to do ben is you're going to pop your foil over the top you're going to place your chosen cardstock over that top you're going to bring your top plate back in and you slide it out. Always important, slide out. And then run through your Gemini Junior. It's been designed to fit through the Junior perfectly. However, if you have the larger Gemini, you just pop that onto your adapter plate and run that through. And then literally, all we're going to do, Ben, is we're going to take it off, take that around, and you peel that back to create ah. the most beautiful foil stamp and again it's absolutely incredible however what we actually have now is the die so i'm just going to move my foil press out of the way just for a second then we've got the die now to cut out that sentiment so oh, yeah. i'm just going to trim this down for a second with my um and i'm going to show you as well could bring in your mini so you could run it through your machine again however this is going to fit through your mini 
perfectly. You're going to hold that into place with a bit of low tack tape again. Let me just bring in my low tack tape. Let's just pop that down. So hold it into place, one side, one side, and then I'm just going to bring in one of my mini plates, bring in my mini machine. Let me just stretch over there. And now this is the die cut element. Now this can be run through all your larger machines as well. And what you could do is foil quite a few onto yeah. one sheet. And then you could do the die cutting element afterwards as well. So you can so just you... foil with it. Yeah. Just cut with it or foil and cut with it. Absolutely. You can do yeah. both. You can absolutely do both. And what that does then is when you release that, you've now got your sentiments all foiled and ready to go. Love it. Onto your project, whatever it is that you're going to... Um, Celebrate the wonder of Christmas. And literally, it's so super easy to do. Imagine foiling lots of sentiments, die-cutting lots of sentiments, popping them in a little box. Then when it comes to finishing your card projects or whatever it is that you're making for Christmas, gifts and things like that, because you could make that into a tag, just yeah. punch, punch a little hole through there, add a little bit of ribbon, and you've got yourself a beautiful little tag to go in your bag as well. But imagine having those to hand already. How long did that take? Oh, minutes. Two minutes? Literally, hardly any time at all. But what you've got in your hand is that beautiful, perfect foiling absolutely exquisite and it really really is exquisite foiling there is no other machine on the market that foils like our gemini foil press and you're getting five sentiments in that bundle at that incredible price what does that work out at producer laura uh, it works out at about three pounds three pounds twenty wow 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 Doesn't wow it? for foil stamped Sentiments. Yeah. Oh, well, I cannot. Then. But honestly, I'm sure. I am shocked. Yeah. I'm not shocked. It's cartload. What are you talking about, Debbie? You're not shocked. It's cartload. Yeah. This is when we bring you those special deals. This is a special deal tonight because these are beautiful and they're that lovely Christmas sentiment that are going to enable and take you take it onto another level. You're crafting. Absolutely fabulous. Love them. Uh, Carol's just got in touch to say I absolutely love my foil press. I know. Come on. They're amazing, aren't they? Uh, and remember with these, you're gonna get some of the greatest gifts of family and friends. Tis the season to be jolly. Uh, celebrate the wonder of Christmas, which is the one we saw. Wishing you all the happiness your holiday can hold and Christmas blessings for all five for 16.97 or 22.85. Uh, it is um, a brilliant deal, saving 11.98 or 15.90 on those. Um, also, just to reiterate, the uh, last chance saloon items that we've had, Remember at the start of the show, well, we sold out about 10 of them. Uh, we had another sellout. The poinsettia is going to be the next one to go. Lots of you have got this in your basket right now. Um, but just kind of warning you that that is going to go. If you've got that in your basket, check it out because you run the risk of missing out. And lots of other bits and pieces will sell out as we head through the show as well. Um, I can't believe we've got um, just over 20 minutes remaining. So we're going to go back to um, one of my absolute faves off the show. Which are these stencils? I've really got into the idea of stenciling over the last few weeks because we had that um, uh, the sort of stenciling 101 a little bit earlier. Uh, was it in the, this week? No, it must have been last week. Um, just showing you how useful stencils are and uh, how easy they are to use as well. I really think these are brilliant because um, if you wanted to get into craft, if you're not wanting to have to spend a fortune, but you're still wanting to be able to create some amazing projects, stenciling is a great way to go because um, you're not having... You don't have to be too precise with this, do you, really? Once you've got the stencils, and as long as you're kind of you know, working within the guidelines, you can create these amazing 3D images very, very quickly and very, very easily uh, indeed. Um, have a look through all the different inks that you've got you know, um, at home. Think about um, all the different things that you can use with these as well. And think out of the box, not just for your crafting projects, your cards, but home decor ideas. I, I, I still can't get out of my mind when uh, Debbie was telling us earlier on about you know, using these to kind of decorate cupboard doors when she was using them, you know, in the kitchen. Uh, I think it's great. And these are nice, sizable um, stencils as well. Now, with each of these, you're going to get your carte postale. That's the one we saw a little bit earlier on. If you missed the show, uh, missed the show. If you missed the start of the show, uh, you'll be able to watch that back on YouTube, on Facebook. Go and look for it because it, it was a brilliant demo. Now, you're also going to get your postmark Paris. This city skyline is amazing. You can't quite see that, can you? Hang on, I've got them down here. Oh, have I? No, let me get it off here. Come on, Ben. There we go. Uh, your city skyline, again, take a look at that. It's absolutely gorgeous. And then you're also going to get your, uh, your French vine as well, which is the, uh, the grapes. 
love it. Uh, so you get three um, stencils within each collection and each of those stencils adds another layer and builds them up to something which is, well, truly unique. The price on this, again, phenomenal. $9.99 is what you would normally pay for one. You're getting $11.98 or $14.34 for all four of them. So it's almost as if this is the way I work it out. You pay $9.99 for one, so it's like you're getting the other three for £1.99 or uh, what does it work out? In a I can't do it in the States, my mind's not working quick enough. But you, you get the point here. It works out at less than £1 per stencil. Loads of you. Uh, say how much you love the stencils. Uh, Bernie says these are gorgeous stencils. Uh, I have them and I love them. Um, lots of love for them actually. Lots of love for the stencils coming in. Fill up your baskets and make sure you grab those goodies as quick as you can because Cartload is all about fast and furious and with uh, 20 minutes remaining, things will go. Now, uh, Debbie is, uh, I think, almost prepared and ready for another demo. We are going to have a look at these stencils because, as I say, they're beautiful, they're amazing, and actually, they're quite simple to use as well, Debbie, aren't they? Super simple to use, Ben. Absolutely super simple to use. Just been scrabbling around, trying to get all the bits <laughs> together there. Because things keep selling out, so I'm now having to change your demos yeah. up a little bit. However, it's all good fun when it comes to cartload. But these really are very, very easy to use. And I still... I honestly, hand on heart, thought that was the one, one set of stencil prize tonight. I can't believe you're getting all four to create everything. Bonkers. It's just a bonkers, crazy prize, which is why it's fast become my firm favourite today. Uh, but it is this easy. It's three steps to create dimension and layering with ease. If you're just starting out on your craft journey and you're thinking, what can I get into? What is it that's going to be affordable for me to get into? Uh, before it becomes addictive uh, but honestly <laughs> this literally is the best way to start a couple of inks these stencils and you're good to go and you can stencil absolutely anything but i want you to think about other things that you've got on your stash things like your texture pastes your glitter cape, your glitter pastes which are fabulous and create beautiful dimension added dimension if you love your mixed media those are the things to go for you can take these onto canvases and create beautiful backgrounds mm. have it all in white texture paste and then you can start adding your colors into there and your gilding waxes and your different paints you can create some real beautiful effects but i'm going to show you how simple these are to use in that one two three system because each one of these show you how you build this up so you can see this one here is the first one and these are perfectly done in that simple in fact i'll hold uh, oh, uh, wait a minute wait a minute ben i need my black cardstock again so you can see them absolutely perfectly pop the black cardstock that is your first stencil so that's the one we're going to use the first yeah then you have the second stencil and again Ooh, really yes. beautiful you can see the layering coming up and then the last one and when you build these up together you're going to create something really beautiful i'm going to use again just some of our inks and i'm going to use things like um, well i've got a mixture because i've lost i've lost one of our studio when i say i've lost you lost the studio. I don't. Maybe. I haven't lost the studio one. I don't know where <laughs> they've gone. I got accused the other day. I was watching the, watching the program, and everybody was blaming me. Who was accusing you? I was like, you? excuse me. Who was blaming you, Debbie? Well, actually, I'm pretty sure it was when you was with Fiona. M you know? Me? Was it you? Or was it? Or was it? Am I blaming you now, Ben? Me? Am I blaming you? Me? In fact, you know what? I think it was. I think it was Joe. Thank I think you. It was Joe. I mean, we're easily confused, me and Joe, aren't I we? I know. Yeah, he won't be watching, so it's fine. No. I get away with it. No. But Fiona, that they could it was me that put the lemon tonic in the wrong package. Oh, I'm no, like, that was me. Oh, was it you? Yes, I remember that show, but what it wasn't me. What are you no, like? No, 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 Debbie. It wasn't me. It was Fiona who was accusing <laughs> you. I was just stood back here going, I, I stood back here and I went, Oh, I tell Somebody you. Somebody was whispering in Fiona's ear. That's what it was. I heard, I knew what was going off. I was watching. I was like, how dare them? Me? Me as well. Probably were me, but because <laughs> I'm a little bit ditzy and a little bit forgetful. Mm. However, ain't it innocent till proven guilty, Ben? Absolutely, it is. Yes. Absolutely. Yes. Now, I don't know who's misplaced the quick dry crushed velvet, but I'm not going to worry because guess why, Ben? Why? They all work in harmony with each other. Hey. Boom, boom! I got there. I see I got what you did there. there. <laughs> see what you did there. You see what I did? Oh, I love it. So I'm going to bring down first the palest colour and I'm just holding that into place. Like I said, right back at the very beginning, if you want to use something like um, low-tack tape to hold it into place, by all means do so. Um, 
Uh, also, you can use your stick and spray, which is your repositional spray, which will hold it into place. But guess what I'm doing, Ben? What? Risking it for, for a biscuit. biscuit. <laughs> Oh, I'm talking about biscuits. I could oh, really. Don't. I've seen an half-eaten Kit Kat down here. Oh, I'm blaming yeah. Sarah because, although it could be Fiona actually, but I've I was eaten. saying, and actually, it could have been Craig. Could have well, been Craig because he's always in his treats. Isn't he? he loves his treats. I've eaten that cake which um, I had in the studio, which um, I thought it was from producer Laura, but Sarah apparently brought some cakes, and so I've eaten that one. Why uh, didn't she bring me a... some cake in? Mm, what's well, going on there? there? I didn't get the cake. It's in. It's in. It's in the gallery. There's. Um, there's a selection of um, cakes oh, and whatnot in there. Oh, it's thin now. Oh then. yeah. Oh yeah. They, they are definitely dwindling. Like, like the stock on cartload is dwindling. Uh, the cake <laughs> and biscuits in the gallery are dwindling. By the way, um, just want to say, with um, 15 minutes left, if there's any questions you want to ask us, if there's anything that you want to, um, uh, you know, show um, or know, get in touch. And actually, let us know what your favourite deals have been on cartload today. What have you? purchased what would you uh like to grab um maybe you're thinking about getting before the end of the show get in touch and as i said use debbie while she's here uh any questions you've got 15 minutes to get those in and then uh yeah we'll be done ready of course for the uh eight to ten preview show which is coming up very soon four oh, hour blockbuster with wow. craig derek and derek oh. and uh sarah derek <laughs> so you guys call him derek up here don't you Oh, I love it. I love it. Now, it's going to be fabulous. Absolutely fabulous. Now, did you see the first one, Ben? That's yep. the first layer. Uh -huh. You're going to watch the magic come alive when you start to add the rest of the colours onto there. So I'm putting my second sten layering stencil over the top. And this time I'm going to go in with my crushed velvet. And I'm going to take this. Oh, it's beautiful, this crushed velvet. Oof. It's absolutely gold. I love crushed velvet. But again, you can use your different inks. So this is the crushed velvet Harmony Water Reactive ink pad uh, mixed with the Quick Dry ink pad. You could even go as far as using the pigment or, pi Ooh, or pig pigment one. And then you could use your things like your crystal clear um, embossing powder over the top because it's an open, it, it stays a bit wetter longer. That makes sense. It doesn't mm. dry as quick as the quick dry does, which is instant, by the way. Um, and they're all water-based as well, so you can create your lovely water techniques with them too. So absolutely fabulous. Lots of options, but I think the best option would definitely be taking your texture paste and those kind of things to yeah. really build up and create something. And Debbie's hoping she hasn't moved it too much while she was talking there. I like uh, it when you get the old glitter paste on there and you you know, you know you get the old little trowel out, don't you? And absolutely. Scrape it but over. can you see it building yeah. up now, Ben? Look yeah. how gorgeous that looks with the second layer. So shall we go in with the third and final yeah, layer? You can see that Take that over and you're going to see this come to life yeah. even more. So this time I'm moving on to the Dams and Wine, which is the darker of those families. But you can really have a play with different colours, experiment with different colours. I'm just choosing the strong family colours here so that you can really see how beautiful this pops when they're all used together. And again, all you're doing is if you want to pop some tape down over the top to hold it in place, do so. Uh, you do what's comfortable for you, or as our Joe would say, you do you, hun. You do you, hun. He does. You do you, hun. I love how he says it, me. It always makes me feel ten times better when he says it as well. Now then, all I'm doing is taking this across and again, lift that off and look at that. I mean, that beautiful on. dimension, that three dimension, it looks incredible. Let's just go close so you can see there how fabulous that looks when you bring that together. It looks incredible. Imagine taking your pastes and popping perhaps on that last stencil, the beautiful glitter paste over the top and how incredible that would look. But how fantastic are these stencils? Three quick, easy steps to create something dimensional, absolutely stunning, at the most amazing price. My jaw did drop that on that floor. It did do that big mouth wide opening because it's an incredible price. I thought that was for one. For four sets of stencils, amazing. It's definitely the deal of Cartload tonight for me. <laughs> Time to get the big voice out. It's the deal of Cartload. <laughs> big deal, isn't it? It's a big deal, honestly. Eleven ninety-eight. It's the great thing is, it's easy to use. You get instant results. You don't have to have done it before, and you can create something which is truly stunning. One, two, three, four, four of those for eleven ninety-eight. Postmark Paris. 
City Skyline, French Vine, and your carte postale is amazing. Has this been your favorite on the show? Let us know, I wanna hear from you, or any of the other deals you've loved. Let us know what has been your fave before the end of our cartload show, 11.98 or 14.34 for your uh, 3D layering stencil collection. Right, next up, uh, let us just show you some other goodies that we've got on the um, cartload show. We've got some Tiffany stuff which we've not even looked at. Your embossing station here, uh, so yeah, you can hold your uh, heat gun in there as well. 2079 or 1999 is the deal on that. Half the stock of that has gone. Now talk about things flying out the door. Your uh, Ditto Tool Tote, we, now we had the pink earlier on, that sold out. Uh, the turquoise I think is on limited oh in fact we're into single figures available of that so if you want it get it before it goes and then also the black we've got more of that in stock but it's nice to have one with a bit of color on it isn't it uh 2017 on $19.99 is the price on the ditto to tool tote that's not easy to say at the end of the day also proving really popular this is great the ultimate crafting seven piece bundle is Cool, because you're going to get your tote bag with this, all right, and then inside there, you're going to get your uh, stick and spray, you're going to get your mounting adhesive. No, I'm not, sorry, I'm looking at the wrong one. Let's get this right, Ben, let's get this right. You're going to get, hang on a minute, where is it? Uh, there it is, you're going to get your tote bag. It's been a long day. You're going to get your uh, low tack tape, three lots of that on the reel. You're then going to get your uh, nine inch straight scissors and your four, four piece precision tweezers thrown in for free. You're going to get the Collal Tacky Glue, the fine tip glue applicators, two of those, and two pokey tools as well. 45, 46 or 62, 80, over 15% off. Great gift idea. Uh, and again, you know what? If you perhaps are just thinking, oh, I only really want the tote bag, you can then share out all the goodies to other people, use them as gift ideas, stocking fillers for Christmas, because it will be here before you know it. Also proving very popular is the Spray and Sparkle three-piece collection. Um, I would show you these in the studio, but I dropped mine on the floor and broke them. Apologies. Uh, but you can still go for all three here. Within the three collection, you get your silver, you get your uh, pearl glitter, and you get your gold. Don't they make a lovely noise when you give them a shake? Oh yeah, because I broke them. Uh, 13 98 is your uh, price on that. UK only, by the way. Other things to just uh, mention to you. Uh, the Winter Wonderland Metal Dye. We've got a few of these available, but not many. Uh, beautiful sparkling snowflake is six pounds or eight dollars. Last chance saloon on that. We've then also got the Contemporary Tree. Again, these are all kinds of things that you can just uh, chuck into your basket, take advantage of the deals. I mean, that should be 13 pounds or almost $17. It's six pounds or $8 uh, for that beautiful metal dye tree. Uh, next up, we've got the Stick and Spray and Stick Away Bundle. You're getting three of those, $15.98. Again, apologies to our American viewers. That is a, a UK only deal, but grab that whilst you can. And also proving really, really popular is the Autumn Pack or the Fall Pack, as our American friends are calling it. As I said, we've had this on cartload, I think certainly last week as well, big stock. And uh, I think now over 40% of it has gone. It's just popped up at the right time of the year, really, hasn't it? And the fact that the value for money on this is amazing too. So it's $5.99 or $9.99, uh, 10 pounds or $16 for two. And you get a selection of cardstock in different weight and then you get the beautiful paper as well. So you've, you've got the cardstock, beautiful sheen and shine on that too. In the orange, so beautiful for your uh, autumnal makes, you know, Halloween as well, fast approaching. You've got some colors here which will suit your Christmas card making as well. And actually, as you go through this, I, we mentioned this earlier, it is called an autumn pack, but when you look through, you have got some almost like spring and summery colors in there too. Um, so get this really as a great craft room filler, great that you don't want to run out of your papers and your cardstock, and great for the fact that yes, whilst you have got some um, autumnal colors in there, you have got colors, I think, for all seasons as well. $5.99 or $9.99 for that set, or two for 10 or two for 16 if you want to um, bulk up and stock up. Right, we've literally got about six minutes left, so let's get over to Debbie for one final demo. What can you do quickly? Butterflies. Ah, I knew it. I love a butterfly, and one of my favorite from the butterfly kit is this folder. This is the 3D 
majestic butterflies embossing folder and it's absolutely incredible it really is a fabulous butterfly embossing folder and honestly ben what it creates is just how this works it's sensational you get the most beautiful depth and dimension when it comes to this 3d now honestly ben yes so so easy to use again i've taken a piece of centura pearl this time i'm going to place it in there now if you're ever wondering when it comes to a 3d folder you can feel where the raised edge is to where the recess part is so i know that this here is the raised element and this is so if you were doing letterpress techniques it's always worth a feel however pop those in i know now when i run that through i'm going to create a beautiful beautiful um image with the 3d folder now 3d folders for the uh, plate combination in a gemini is you place your uh cutting plate on the bottom place your folder into the middle of that folder and that wait a minute your card stock into the middle of the folder that yeah, was it the okay, right I was about to say put the folder in the folder no not the folder in the folder the card stock in the then folder. you've got your magnetic shim on and then your plastic shim now there may be an exception to the rule where you don't need that much pre uh, that much in your plate combination and you would take out your magnetic shim however i'm going to run that through and see what this creates. You can create an extra bit of oomph by adding that extra bit. What you mustn't do with a 3D fold though is no. pop the two cutting plates in together. I had somebody message me the other night, bless her, and she said she wasn't getting the right, right combination for it. And it's just making sure you, I mean, look at that. It's oh, incredible. Look, wow. at the, look at the depth and dimension onto there. Do you know what I'm gonna do just to highlight it? I'm gonna yeah. bring in a uh, grasshopper. Oh yeah. And then I'm just might just run a bit of uh, gilding wax we over the top as well. Building wax on the show as well for we you, have uh, that indeed. free collection. Just to mention also the autumn pack, the four pack of cardstock and paper, that's now 60% gone. Um, so go swiftly. Oh wow, look at this. Yeah, and maybe. Uh, your uh, cardstock or your paper with this particular collection. Uh, you know, you've got the spring colours in there as well. You can have your butterflies for different seasons, I suppose, wouldn't you really? But look at that. That is an impressive emboss. And then we're going to add some of the gilding wax. We've yes. got three gorgeous colours on the show. We have uh, Renaissance gold, antique gold, and my absolute favourite, king gold. So again, I'm just going to take a little bit onto my finger and I'm going to run that across the embossing folder. And it really does add a beautiful extra extra element over the top that beautiful metallic sheen that you get from gilding and it's an incredible saving tonight on the gilding waxes for three pots of fabulous gold colors and they are beautiful these yeah. men. I love these I've got in fact it's got absolutely my favorite gold in there antique gold and king gold are my two favorites um, and then you've got the beautiful Renaissance gold yeah. as well. And again, just by adding that over, it adds that little bit of depth and dimension, a little bit of extra uh, sheen on there as well. And I just need a little bit of a cloth just to buff that up over the top. And again, you're creating something really fabulous with an embossing folder. Now, if I just hold that up close, I don't know if we can get that in close there, where you can see that sheen, that shine, and that beautiful 3D-ness when it comes, oh, look at that. You can, did you catch that there? Look at that. Look at that, Ben. Just look at that beautiful gold awesome. there. Awesome. Absolutely incredible. Absolutely one of my favourite, favourite folders. Really beautiful. And you can then start to add things that to your boxes or your cards or anything like that. It's incredible. And it's a brilliant price tonight because you're not just getting the embossy folder. Oh, you're no. getting everything else in that beautiful collection as well of the beautiful butterflies. Fabulous. Fabulous. And, and honestly, you do get all of that as well. So it's a half price deal, whether you're with us in the UK or in the States. Yes, you will get that amazing um, 3D embossing folder included in there, but you also get as you can see these beautiful uh, intricate um, trellis dies you get the border die and that beautiful uh, floral frame as well that lace frame I should say then you're going to get your butterfly dreams which is the stamp and die collection that one you saw a little bit earlier on in the show uh, and then you've got the rose bloom stamp and die again plus the uh, just to say stamp as well it's a huge bundle uh, and you can just get a bit of a glimpse of an idea of some of the things that you can make with this wonderful set 
38 pounds or 62 dollars and just before we go it might just be worth just popping quickly back over to debbie uh, to take a look at some of the samples like the, i mean take a look at this for home decor gorgeous I love, I love the home decor piece it's just beautiful and it's using that butterfly dreams on there so you can see and they've been stamped onto vellum ben to vellum to create a beautiful beautiful feature there and again stamped with a gorgeous gold metallic ink they absolutely look beautiful they really do there's other elements in there as well ben so you can see the kind of things that you can create using that gorgeous kit and it really is fabulous there's lots of different ways you can use it one of my favorites where's it gone where's it gone ben where's it gone oh what have i done with that sample oh i must have misplaced it my lovely twisted easel one i don't know what i've done with it however i've got a lovely easel here as well so using that gorgeous frame uh and the lovely elements on there as well it's just fabulous have you got time for one quick question before we go of course I am, can, yes. Uh, LJ says, Debbie, how do you stop a shadow emboss when putting embossing folders through? A shadow emboss? Yeah. Does that mean a shadow emboss? Yeah, that's what it says. Have you put that through twice or once? That's what I'd need to know because mm. you shouldn't get a shadow emboss. It's just one crisp, clean embossing detail that you should get when you run it through once. Danger is if you put it through a couple of times or bring it back on a reverse function, yeah. is that it can the cardstock can move within the folder ah. and then you can create that double, like a, it looks like a, like you've got a bit of double vision because yes. it looks like a shadow behind it. Uh, but yes, absolutely. If that's what you mean. If not, send me a message via my Facebook page, Debbie Robinson Crafters Companion, and I'll sort you out. There you go. Can't say fairer than that, can you? Well, boy, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. That was cartload and it was unbelievable. I've got to say a big thank you to one of my absolute faves. She's just, she's, she's disappeared. There she is. Uh, Debbie, thank you. Should we do this again tomorrow? We'll do another Absolutely. show. Absolutely. Tomorrow afternoon, Ben. Same time, same place. Yeah, go on Absolutely. then. Absolutely. Uh, lovely, Debbie. Thank you so much. Thank you for watching as well. More to come. I'm here with you tomorrow again at uh, one and four. And of course, uh, very exciting for our uh, American viewers. We've got the HSM preview show uh, coming up from seven o'clock UK time. Four hours featuring Derek, featuring Craig, and of course, Sarah will be there as well. It's going to be amazing. Have a brilliant day, whatever you're up to, and we will catch you back here at uh, Craft... Uh, yes, Crafters TV is where we are, Ben. We'll catch you then. I'm going for a lie down. Bye for now. <laughs>